Hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to this amazing free-for-all challenge. It's amazing. We're gonna have some fucking great players here tonight. Seriously, it's, it's, wow, it's inspiring, okay? It's inspiring. So let me just create the room. Let me go ahead and wait for everyone to join. This is gonna be uh, potentially a problem because I think a lot of people are gonna join here. But we'll, we'll see, right? We'll see. So what is this challenge? Well, this challenge is a rather awesome challenge set up by AKA Baloney, who's sponsoring this. So thank you very much, mate. And essentially what's gonna happen is we're gonna basically do a mini reenactment of uh, the Instant Shock Fast Cash Tournament. So we're gonna play, um, actually, sort of, right, sort of. So we're gonna follow the Instant Shock Fast Cash rules, which I will give a link to you guys. Give me, give me a second here. Um, here we go, I posted the link. You probably have to scroll up because there's a stream delay. So here are the rules, and the rules are very nice and simple. Uh, if you guys scroll down, I can actually put it on my screen here. Let me do that, it might be a little easier. Give me a minute. Oof. Okay, there we go. So these are the scores that we're gonna be using. So if you win a match, you get seven points, you come second place, you get five points, blah, 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 all the way until fifth and sixth place that both still get two points. You also get a point for killing a guy on your own, you know, like, hey, you know, rushing one guy, killing him, you get an extra point. You know, you kill another guy, hey, you get another point. The only thing is you don't get extra points when you have a 2v1 situation. So we might see some nice nastiness happening where people literally come in to kill off another player just to make sure someone doesn't get the point. That's all allowed, that's all good. Uh, furthermore, regarding maps, we're gonna be doing uh, DEFCON, and then we're gonna do another one of Instant Shock Arena version two. Ooh. And then we're going back to DEFCON. So we're gonna do three matches in total, and then we're gonna tally up all the scores and points and whatever. And the first place person is gonna get a hundred dollar. Ooh, not too bad, not too bad. And second place is gonna get 35, and the third place is gonna get 15. So that isn't that isn't bad at all. That's very nice, actually. Ooh. Okay, so let's actually see if these guys have joined. Give me a second here. Um, here we go. Oh shit, I'm on Discord. Yeah, I'm gonna close Discord now. Um, yeah, I'm gonna close Discord. Sorry, guys. Because you know how I am. When I cast, I generally just do it on my own. I'm okay with that. I'm happy with that. And let's see. Ooh, we have most people here. Is this the right Dominator? Let me just check. Can someone verify Domi is the right Domi? Because I don't have him on my friends list. And I don't know who Death is, but he needs to be kicked. So Logica is correct, Chakra is correct, Shay is correct, Rob. We're missing Sniper. Yeah, Sniper's not online. If anybody knows Sniper, go send him a message. Okay, so I love this already. Fake, fake dummy. <laughs> oh, you can't trust Shay on these things, man. You can't trust Shay. Oh, I love him, man. He's so funny. Okay, so yeah, now we're just kind of waiting on Sniper. Um, I think if Anthrax, are you in the chat? Maybe you could let him know. Someone's saying, damn, huge delay. Yes, there is definitely going to be a delay, guys. There has to be a delay because, um, you know, we're, we're playing for money here. So, yeah, you know, we got to have a delay. That's, that's just the truth. Otherwise, it's a bit lame. Normally, when I stream, it's like, ah, oh, well, who gives a shit? But anyway, so let's wait a little lo uh, longer here. Let's try and wait for a sniper to show up. And, um, yeah, so I think this is the real Dominator. He was playing under this name for a while, so I think it's him. Let me just say, does anyone know Sniper? Like, have some personal contact of his. Tell him we're waiting. Let's see. All right, so let's quickly go over the players we have here today. So we have the almighty Logica who's gonna be playing in this challenge. And you guys probably know him. He's the guy who actually won the Fast Cash free-for-all tournament last year. So he's a very good player. He is just overall rather solid. He doesn't really have many weaknesses. Um, the only thing I would say is maybe his army mixing could be just a bit better, but seeing how he's like mainly a 1v1 player, that doesn't really happen, army mixing, like, you know, you steal a dozer and army and things like that. So, wait, actually, let me just... No, I just have to wait for Sniper to come online. 
So yeah, Logica is going to be a very good player. So you guys better look out for him. We have Chaka with us today, who is also a very good player. Uh, the thing is, Chaka has not been playing with us very much. So that is actually going to be his secret weapon. This guy can come up with whatever strats. And I guarantee you, all the other players are not going to be expecting it. He's a very good player. So I wonder how he's going to perform tonight. And then we also have the glorious Shay. I mean, it's Shay, guys. We, we had to have Shay in a free-for-all freaking challenge, right? I mean, Shay's so good, man. So the thing with Shay is he tends to expand very quickly and people don't really notice he expands. And then in the mid-game, he gets very strong. And in the late game, he gets very strong. So he's one to watch out for. He also likes the army steal and he's full of good surprises always. And Rob, you guys know Rob. Oh my god, he's like the king of defenses. So he's going to be a player that is going to be very dangerous in the late game. But in the early game, that's probably his weak point. So if somebody is like, hey, I'm next to Rob, we might see people going for the rush on him. Because that's the easiest way to take him out. If Rob gets too big, he will take over the universe. He is amazing in the late game. And he'll definitely cause some problems for his opponents. Next, we have Dominator, who we all know, and he is quite a formidable FFA player as well. Uh, just like Rob, he generally starts with a bit of a bunkery approach. That being said, sometimes he does go for a direct rush, and that's what makes him so lethal as well. If you're next to him, you don't know if he's going to bunker up, you don't know if he's going to rush you, and that little bit of insecurity there, that's what makes it so hard to fight him. So I'm sure we're going to see some great stuff out of him as well. And the last person we're waiting for is Sniper. Sniper, where are you? Uh, what happens if Sniper doesn't show? If Sniper doesn't show, we'll play with someone else. That's, that's the truth. Someone says, you're going to play in this tourney, right? Well, this is a challenge, uh, just a one live stream challenge thing. And um, actually, I will not be playing. I'll be casting this so you guys can all sit back and listen to my smooth voice as I say, Oh my god, he's killing him! And things like that. So, you know, yeah. Maybe next time I'll play. But um, uh, I don't know. I actually didn't speak to the sponsor about it, whether I would play or cast. I just kind of assumed that he'd want me to cast. But, you know, he's a cool guy. Maybe next time I'll play. We'll see. You know, We might do more of these challenges in the future. <gasps> maybe, maybe. So, yeah, okay. Um... Still no signs of Sniper. Let's uh, let's wait three more minutes. Then we uh, change player. I think I think that's um, I think that's the best thing to do. I see Recon saying, "Stop revealing their skills, dude. Their skills are definitely going to be revealed." I like I like these things, right? I like these things. Uh, anyway, so guys, in the chat, tell me right now, who do you think will win? Who do you think has a chance? to win these matches. So we're gonna be playing three games, right? Three games. And um, we're using the point system, so someone could actually win this without ever reaching first place. It's all possible, you know? It's more it's more like a little bit of a skill-oriented way of measuring. It's not 100% accurate, so if, the, if someone wins this, it doesn't guarantee he's the best free-for-all player ever. But, you know, there's always some random elements in free-for-all, always. But... Okay. Still waiting. Oh man, I hope Sniper's alright. Let me actually send a message um, to someone. Ooh, I got a Facebook message. Ooh. Anyway, let me let me try and get a hold of Sniper here, guys. Because I do think he will make an excellent addition here. So if you guys want to quickly get yourself a drink or some snacks, now is your chance. You may do so. Okay, I'm getting a response here. I'll keep an eye on my friends list as well. Okay, so Anthrax just uh, told me that he's going to get in touch with Sniper and Sniper should be on the way. So, yes, it probably won't be too long. So let's just chill out a bit, you know, like, seriously, guys, how was your day? How was your day? Oh, I like this. I see people saying, Dominator's going to win. Shay's going to win. Logic is going to win. Yeah, this is the problem, right? It's someone else saying Rob. I mean, everyone's saying different names because they're all such great players. It's so hard to tell. 
Flex will win. Yeah, yeah. Flex will somehow magically win this. I agree. I agree. Definitely. Alright, so Dominator seems to have left. Maybe... Did he go offline? Where is he? Okay, Dominator had said, be right back. Let me just add him so I know that I have the right Dominator. Boyka will win! <laughs> 31844. Okay. There we go. Just double check what's going on. Alright, three minutes are up, but I did get confirmation that um, Sniper is coming. Sorry about this, guys, but this is what happens when you try and coordinate with a load of people. These things, they just happen. We'll just have to wait, sit tight. Yeah, I know Discord chat is frozen. Oh wait, is even the overlay frozen? What? No, the overlay isn't frozen. Look, I can select here. Yeah, just the Discord chat thing. But that's because I closed Discord, because uh, there's no need for me to have Discord open. And you know, it just sucks bandwidth. Yes, it does. Okay, let's see. All right, it might be that Sniper might not be able to make it. So we have a reserve player on standby. All right, let me just tell everyone to get the map as well, because we're going to be playing uh, Instant Shock Arena version 2. And I know not everyone has that map, so I will just tell everyone... Yeah, don't worry, Shay, don't worry. Okay, Domi is here, let's kick. Clear a space. Oh, I can just kick all these guys. All right. Yeah, I think that we're not able to actually get a hold of Sniper here, so I think we're gonna have to go on without him, unfortunately. That would be a real pity. Okay, yeah. Sniper man, you will be missed. Ah, oh, that's a real pity. Okay. Well, that brings 
our guy on standby into the scene. Oh man. Pity. I feel bad for Sniper because this was going to be really fucking cool and awesome. But instead, we now have Mr. Malik. Malik will be taking Sniper's place here. Alright, so we have Dominator, and we are complete, right? Two, four, six, yes, we're ready. So I'm gonna change this to seven players, and I'm gonna close all the things I've opened. Give me a second here. Okay. So I think we're good to go, so we're gonna use the iShock um, Fast Cash Tournament point system. You get one point for each person you kill. 2v1 will killing someone with 2v1 will not get you a point. <clears throat> you can use this trick to prevent a player from getting the point by quickly coming in and finishing off a player. Very nasty, but it's allowed. Wink, wink. For the rest, you will earn points depending... Wait one sec. Depending on the position you place. First place gets seven points. Second place gets uh, five points. Third place, four points. Fourth place. Place three points. Fifth and sixth place give two points and for the rest it's it's pro rules one super weapon for super weapon general no demo upgrade um and what else was it right an air force carpet bomb is always allowed here's the that's the link for the map yeah it's pro rules yes because six players we always do pro rules it's just eight players more chaotic, right? But with six players, we see more skill with pro rules. So that's always nice. Uh, let me just update my casting here because, um, I mean, my, my screen here because no sniping, no. So I'll put them at the end. I know I had it alphabetically organized, so now <laughs> it's a bit out of whack, but whatever. You guys will forgive me, I'm sure. And I think we are ready for the game. Let me just see what the players are saying. Was that the case last time? Yes. Exactly the same as last time. We'll do... We'll start with a DEFCON match. Then we do iShock Arena V2. Then we do another DEFCON. Already, guys. Let's do this. Are you ready? Alright. Okay, our players are ready. So now we're gonna have Logica become the hosts. Because, like this, we actually reduce the lag a little bit. It's a nice little trick that I found out. Remember, I tested it last week. So, this should actually work out nicely. And, uh, yeah, let's, let's see what happens, boys. Let's see what happens. I'm very curious. Who is going to win at these matches? Oh. oh. Okay. So we have with us, we have Chaka, we have Dominator, we have Logica, we have Rob, we have Shay, and we have Malik. Who's going to take the first win? I wonder. Tell me now, in the chat, who do you think is going to win the first match? And who do you think might just win this challenge tonight? Would it be the same person? Would it not? Who knows? Everything is possible. And let's see. All the players have joined. I'm here too. Wee! I get to observe. Yay! Okay, who bets I get the small spot again? It's possible, it's possible. All right, here we go. We are starting the first match. It's happening, boys. It's happening, you better believe it. And look at those lovely armies. Oh, they're gorgeous. Okay, look at that. We have just one USA, just one USA. Look at that. All right, so let's quickly go over the armies here. We are not slow loading, and we have Dominator in red as infantry. We have in Cyan, Malik as laser, the only USA in the match. We have Logica, Nuke General here in the green. We got Rob, Pink, Demo, 
And we have Raging Shea here as Tank General Blue. And last but not least, we have Chaka as Stealth General. Logica saying GLA top left. Why is Logica saying that? Why is he saying that? That is very, very interesting. I think he's doing like a waypoint scout or something and just feels like fucking things up, you know? Because this is free for all. You can actually like try and get people to team with you during the game. So during the game, you can chat and say, oh my god, this person's big, or oh my god, he's scary, and you can actually do that. That's allowed. Free for all, that's perfectly okay. What's not allowed is if you start making alliances up front. So you cannot go before the game starts and say, you know, Malik says to Rob, hey, let's team up. That's not allowed, you know. So, but these players, these players are good. They're not going to do that kind of shit. And here we go. We have Rob doing what Rob does best. He's trying to get most money and immediately throwing down a tunnel. Very good move. And we have Logica going a little more defensive here, putting down a fast bunker. We've got a war factory here facing Malik. And Malik's in a bit of a trouble, uh, troubled spot here because he has to defend against two Chinas. And Chinas, they like to rush, man, because it's relatively easy to rush. In fact, Dominator doesn't... Oh, he might use this outpost to rush... Mr. Malik here. Malik even getting a laser tank and a very interesting fire base here. Meanwhile, we do have Rob going for the middle and we have Chaka going for the middle. And let's see what's going on here. We have Shea as tank general also taking quite a defensive stance. All these players are uh, a bit worried about rushing. They, they don't want to rush and then themselves get rushed because that is the fastest way to lose. We seem to be having a fast oil capture going from Chaka, even Dominator here. And Malik is one step ahead. He's already capturing his and uh, yeah, everybody wanting to fast oil capture. We got a nice little battle master here going on Rob. And look at the flying worker here. Demo traps everywhere. Rob trying to survive. And this is the thing. Nuke General is just so hard to deal with with GLA in the beginning. Especially because this is pro rules. Rob can't just build a demo bike to blow this up. And right now, these workers are screwed. And the income here has been denied from a single battle master. There are no oils here taken for Rob. And here comes the dragon tank finishing off the right hand side. And now Rob is relying simply on this little fucking middle spot which is also visible to Malik and Malik might just choose to engage that he's getting his first V and Robin's some trouble he's got a load of RPGs here he wants to come defend himself very nicely placed demo trap I wonder if this is gonna blow up let's see Rob not sure how to engage here he, he's waiting this out he's, he's not repairing this either there we go, he's repairing. We've got a scorpion coming out, but no scorpion rocket. He might want to try and lure. And yes, here we go. Demo Trap activates and actually takes out Battlemaster. The other Battlemaster, because of the explosion, being drawn down to half health. RPGs firing, but there we go. Look at that. That's what you do with the Battlemasters. You come into a nice blob of RPGs and three of them going down for Rob immediately. One very low health. And this is a very dangerous situation for Rob. Logica putting on the pressure. And Rob really depending on this money here. He's going for his oils. He needs that extra cash. And Rob right now just needs a bit more defenses. He needs a bit more units. He needs to take care of this. The Dragon Tank managed to get away on almost no HP. And do these RPGs have a chance of taking out these Battle Masters? Not entirely. Gets a low health though. And we see more Demo Traps being thrown down here from Rob. But this guy is really injured. He's going slow. So it's not quite working out. Meanwhile, we see Shay sending down a, uh, a nice red guard. Check in the middle. And uh, yeah, I have to say, Shay is quite peaceful here. Dominator is uh, quite peaceful as well. And uh, Logica, Logica is the only one who seems to be going here for Rob. And Rob's really having a hard time. <laughs> oh, look at that. A vet 2 battle master. How often do you see that? Oh my god. Very nice. Okay, let's see. What else? We've got two war factories here out of Shay. Got ECMs as well and GATs. Um, interesting choice. I can't really see who Shay wants to start attacking though. Maybe we'll see like some emperors coming here as well. We got a command center now going up. He wants to play it safe. Logica, on the other hand, we're trying to take what he can. He's got this supply here, which means more income, and that makes it harder for Rob to survive this. Mr. T's taken down very gracefully here. This arms dealer, although under attack, is still technically alive, but for how long? We've got the beacon being put here from Shay onto the strat center, so Shay knows that there's a strat center there. And we have a nice Humvee army here. So we see a lot of players, they're kind of uh, unsure of what to do. Uh, we have a, a bit of an engagement here, and Chaka actually trying to go for the full middle here. He's got two supplies, and he's actually eliminating Rob here. Probably not realizing that this is pretty much Rob's only main income. Yes, Rob has the oils, but this was the only main supply now taken out. 
it's a bit of a blow here for Rob, and it looks like Rob might be the first guy who's going to be taken out here in this match. Rob not complaining about Logica, saying, guys, help me, or anything like that. And here we go, Dominator going for the middle. He knows something is wrong. It's been too quiet from the GLA side. He wants to know what's going on. He spots a tunnel network, and these outposts, they give great scouting range. So he can probably see there's supply stash here. He might even see that second supply stash. So Dominator might choose to go for the middle, get some XP, and try and clear out yellow. Rob saying GG, and is eliminated by Logica. A very well done, Logica. Nicely rushed. Nice amount of battle mass. We've got Lotus out here to capture the oil immediately. And that puts Rob at sixth place, which gives him two points. And ladies and gentlemen, you see the points out here. These are the points. I will update them uh, after every match. And uh, then you can see what everyone has. But for now, they're all just zero because nothing's happening yet. And exactly as I predicted, we've got a tank general here who have built some emperors engaging a poor little stealth general. Because stealth general does have a hard time killing these motherfuckers because of the fucking armor. So you need to see like things like a Jarman Kel. And we do have a palace out from Yellow, from Chaka. So we might see a Jarman coming here. And a Jarman is an excellent way of dealing with these guys. Also, another, right, uh, another good trick would be if Yellow finds ways to harass Blue, like try and deny income, blow up the oil, things like that. Because then he can't really spam out overlords. And a Jarman should be able to take care of everything. We've got two quads, no, three quads here. You cannot engage this with quads. It's way too dangerous. Quads are just not going to do anything. And let's see. Shea paying attention. He's gunning down the quads. And the quads are trying to escape. But already, look at that. Two quads down and this one's disabled. It's so risky. And look at this. There's no damage done here. Like a tiny bit. I think this was even damage for, done from before. So unbelievable, man. We got Logica actually continuing the push here. Look at this. Logica has an Overlord, three Battle Masters, and an ECM, and a Dragon Tank. He might be able to take out Shea here. Shea doesn't have anything on this side. These ECMs might have been put on guard mode, but now, right now, Shea is getting the message of your base is under attack. And Shea is gonna look and say, oh fuck. We might see these guys make a nice big fat U-turn and go back to base, because if he doesn't do that, he will for sure die. Shea right now is on level 2. He's not level 3. He can't do a mine drop to kill this. He can't call in an RT barrage. Logica already is level 3. We might see a nuke bomber. Do we see a command center? Oh, look at this! Oh, Malik! Look at Malik! Taking the opportunity, realizing that Logica is weakly defended. Logica has a big base, a lot of area, but it's not quite airtight. And look at the amount of Vs here. Logica really in some trouble here. Building another war factory very quickly. And look at this army. This is a nice army to try and engage the Humvees. I don't know if Battlemaster is the right move, because if this blows up, he doesn't have the isotope stability, so this Battlemaster dying will injure the other units. But Malek really doing a fucking pincer maneuver here on Logica. Logica has two dozers, one on each island, so he won't get dozer hunted. But in fact, look at this. Logica continues to push and stall Tank General. Oh my god, Logica stole Tank General. Logica right now has two China armies. That means he can get two internet centers as well. Why the fuck not? That is fucking amazing. Okay, so the cell didn't come through here for Shea. Shea actually now trying to take out a bit more of yellow and just simply move to this island. A very interesting tactic, but will it pay off? That is the question. And uh, actually, this, this Emperor doing good damage. Look at this. Will, will these gats kill this guy? No, they won't. Oh, man, these are so tough to deal with. Meanwhile, we've got Malek realizing that this is a bit of a scary army, so he decides to push back. He killed one oil, killed some buildings. Malek, in fact, level 2 here. Um, he still needs 500 XP to hit level 3, so he still has uh, a way to go. But he was like, you know what? I'll get some nice XP. I'll do that. Meanwhile, we see Chaka moving here to the middle, trying to keep everything alive. But it's dangerous being in the middle, especially when there's an infantry general around who probably by now is getting kind of starved for XP. Right now, Dominator has only 31 XP. He's killed practically nothing, and he's trying to keep it cool, keep quiet, and build up his eco. He's got a lot of hackers here, and that's how he intends to win this game. But let's see what's gonna happen. Actually, Shea managed to clear up this army here from Logica. Very well done. And Logica now can't continue to push onto Shea. Because he has to deal with Malik. Malik is here. Malik is a problem. And Malik is doing a lot of hit and run tactics. And ooh, look at that. Oh, one Humvee goes down. So that's the thing. Overlords is just so fucking powerful, man. 
two fucking tank shells and a bit of a gat cannon and a Humvee goes down. It goes that fast. So Malak really has to be careful. We've got 42 latency here. I think you guys can see that, all right? 42 latency means that you can't really micro Humvees with full comfort. It's a bit difficult. It's not impossible. It's just rather difficult. And here we go. Now we see an assault here on the middle. So Malek, essentially, by the looks of it, he just wants points. He wants to reach level 5, get things like Moab. And Logica, actually, right now, look at this. We've got a bomber plane coming in. Arty Barrage as well being sent. Where is this plane going to go? Is it going to go on the oil? That would be a big blow to Mr. Malek because that is a lot of his income. Carpet, very nice on the oil. Takes him nice and low. And we got Arty coming in here to finish the job. Let's see if it works out. And yes, it works out. So right now, Malik is only on one supply. That's all his income. He's got nothing else left. He's got a nice big army. And ooh, look at this. So Jarman did come through here for yellow, and he did steal an emperor. In fact, yes, yellow did manage to push back Shay. And look at this. Shay's still alive, guys. He's still alive. Logica can't keep the pushing. And Shay is just going to defend himself a bit. In fact, he might use this to engage yellow now. And uh, yeah, look at this. Logica going in for the kill. And that was actually a very nice A-10 there. Took out pretty much everything. Just two overlords left. And these zombies can clean this up quite nicely now. And Malek is on a level 3. Logica is on level 4. So this is a very high pressure game. The moment you have to deal with a level 5 USA. Oh man, it, it's so difficult. Even as China. Because Malek will get access to Leaflet. Which is very good for disabling incoming armies. He'll have Moab. Which is great for just blowing up oil or hackers or whatever. So yeah... Logica has to be careful. He needs to make sure that the next few attacks, he's not going to lo uh, lose much. Logica says no nuke mix. That's correct. It's no nuke mix. It's pro rules. And look at this. Actually, Chaka managed to steal a Humvee as well, and he's making use of that. Chaka is not dead yet, guys. He is not dead yet. He's got the middle. He's mining quite nicely. So, hmm. Very interesting. Very interesting. But, look. Right now, Malik is trying to mine here from the middle. And actually, he seems to be managing all right. So yes, even though he lost the oil, he is still mining in the middle, but that will always be short-lived. A USA mining from the middle is very tough to keep up. And um, we have a nice outpost here from Logica, seeing what the hell is going on. And Logica realizing he has no hackers. That is correct, sir. Two bunkers, trying to keep this area secure, prevent Malak from coming in. And we see Shea doing a mine drop. Shea wants a bit of extra security here. And these two oils still belong to Logica. Right now, Shay trying to go for the middle, trying to do more damage to Mr. Yellow here. Chaka having a hard time, but he's hanging on. He is hanging on. He doesn't seem to have any oils. He still has this money, which is still 16k, so that's not too bad. Meanwhile, he's still mining here. This is soon mined out, but we might see Chaka trying to take this cash down here or up here. We see Arty Barrage coming in here from Shay. That looks like it might go for the middle here. But let's see. Dominator still staying quiet. Still only 31 XP. Let's see how many units he's got destroyed. He's got one unit destroyed. Dominator has been quiet this whole game. Building defenses. Look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six Gatling cannons here on the right-hand side. Six Gatling cannons. We've got three bunkers right here. Dominator digging in nice and deep. Meanwhile, we've got Malik realizing he's low on cash. And he didn't actually get the supply lines upgrade. Malik. Naughty. Get it. You need it. It gives you extra 10% cash. Get it. It's a great upgrade. That's a bit of a mistake here from him. He should have gotten that immediately when he got a search and destroy, which I think he got like seven minutes ago now. Meanwhile, we have Mr. Shea trying to do some more harassment. And oh, almost had the dozer captured there. Ooh, that was very close. But yes, the main battle seems to be between Malik and Logica. Strat Center being taken out by a carpet bomber and also takes out a dozer and a power plant. A good strike, did a lot of damage there. And right now, this might deter Malik from engaging because his Humvees no longer have search and destroy. So trying to, lol. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> some guy just landed here, like came from Mars or some shit. Oh man, but seriously, Malik is screwed here. He's gonna have a hard time dealing with overlords, especially when there's ECMs around. That being said, though, Logica's armies are all kind of small. He keeps dispersing them a bit. And Malik does seem to want to go for an attack here. Yes, no, maybe, perhaps. Uh, he's not, he's not, he's not quite sure. Okay, we've got a new strap being built. 
Meanwhile, we just have a load of hackers here from Dominator. Let's uh, let's actually see his cash here. He keeps his cash relatively low, so he's paying attention to how much money he has, and he keeps queuing more units. It's got a very nice uh, layout here of a building style, right? Like, like 90 degrees and shit. Like, yeah, very very pretty, very, very nice. All right, got Beacon going on. What's Beacon? Beacon is on the mines. Yes, good spot, Mr. Malik. And um, we have a bunch of hackers here. Yes, they are now being put into use. Oh, look at this. Ooh, what happened here? Oh, this is Dominator. Dominator, wait, how did this get destroyed? That is from Logica. Okay, so this somehow got destroyed. I missed that. Was that maybe a Colonel Burton? It probably was, seeing the, the, the blow and whatever. And Dominator is trying to get this Lotus to safety. Doing a bit of harassment to uh, Logica. And uh, he got a bit of XP for it. But meanwhile, we, we have the main battle here between Shay and Chakra. Chakra getting some money here. Shay, how many hackers you got? You got a full internet center by the looks of it and two more hackers. Meanwhile, we see ooh, a very, very expensive investment here into Lixis from Shay. That is expensive shit, boys. As tank general. One tank hunter is 375. One Lix is 2,000. The bunker upgrade is another 400, so that is that is fucking expensive. That's like $4,000 per licks that you're looking at here. More even. And uh, yeah, that's... that's. I hope it pays off for him, that's all I can say. Because against Stealth General, it's not really the best thing to do. You know, licks and shit. But we'll see what happens, right? Got an RT that looks like it's going to be going either for the Strat... Wait, where was the Strat? I thought I saw... No, going for the money. Okay, going for the money. I thought he had a strat. Did he sell the strat because he thought the, the RT was coming here? Oh, man. Okay, meanwhile, we see Logica. He has a nice little army here. Two ECNs. He's got four overlords. And one guy, Vet2. Always very nice. So, these guys are very problematic for Malik. I think what Logica's gonna try and do is he's gonna try and bait out this army. Once this army of Humvees is dead, Logica can just come in and take out Malik. It's that simple. We see... Was that a mind drop? Oh, actually, look at this. We got two hijackers here on the scene. Trying to do some nasty business. But will they? I love hijackers. They are so fucking awesome. No, one gets taken out. But we have another hijacker back here. And there are the mines. No. Oh, there he goes. He bounced. And then vanished into thin air. You know, the regular things. And, uh, yeah, Shay managed to survive there. We got another palace being built. Although there's already an existing palace. So, I think Chaka is trying to... Uh, to defend himself a little better here. We've got a load of buggies, but here come the Lixes. This is why Shay got them. He wanted to take out the buggies and prevent these annoying tunnel pops. But, but, does Chaka have any quads? If Chaka has a bunch of quads, this is very dangerous to do. In fact, I don't see any anti-air here from Chaka. Maybe Chaka made a mistake here. Didn't build anything at all. These Lixes have, seem to have free reign right now and could take out all these markets. That means no more income almost for yellow all he will do is depend on the middle which other players might just attack i mean malik might just take this out try and get some xp and this looks like a very deadly attack from shay here look at that we got four elixirs we got one two bunker elixirs one gatlix and a speaker tower this is very difficult to take out and we don't have an arms dealer here we only have one arms dealer here a second arms dealer being built chaka probably queuing quads like crazy and Shay just taking out all the eco here, all the markets. Shay also level 4 already. He might be the first one to hit level 5 here if he's going to take this out. Let's see. Logica is very close to hitting level 5 as well. But these markets, they give good points, guys. They give good points. And it doesn't look like Chaka has anything to stop this. He's going for the cell. And will this one actually be taken out? Yes, it gets taken out and the hole too. So no cell coming through here for Chaka. Very painful. And Shay hits level 5. And soon after that, Logica hits level 5. And oh my god, Logica. Oh my god. Logica put the mines here. And Malik drives right into it. Losing a load of his Vs. And this is what I was talking about. This is what Logica was waiting for. We might just see Logica engage. Where are his armies? Where are his armies? Where the fuck did they go? Did they die? They keep dying, I tell you, they keep dying. Right now, Logica has a chance to do good damage because the Humvee army is low. But let's go back here to Chaka. We see a nice tunnel pop happening and the Lixes have to be pushed back. 
one of them almost taken out. A vet two Gatlicks, very nice, very lethal. And it looks like uh, it looks like Shay might be able to take out Chaka here. This base doesn't seem to have much left. We've got a palace here. But remember, guys, Shay is level 5, so he has access to Carpet Bomb now. He might just Carpet this, put an RT on it, and there you go. Palace goes down. But let's see what happens. Meanwhile, Chaka does still have the middle. He does have it. So there is a chance he might still be able to survive, assuming no one attacks him. And here comes the RT. Let's see, where does it go? It might go for the palace. Or it might go for here, just to destroy this little pesky little defense section. Got Carpet coming. Seems to be going for the palace. Pallet, the, the carpet bomber actually doesn't get taken out here. And the full bombs, all of them get dropped. Palace down to almost half HP. Arty coming in. Like I said, going for the palace. Palace going down. And there we go. That is the main palace of Chaka. So right now, no more buggies, no more Jarman Kel. And this is the last market that Chaka has. Chaka has to rebuild everything in the middle. And he has to do so fast because Shay, he's got an army. And he's ready to kill Chaka here. Meanwhile, we see Mr. Logica. He has a nice amount of OVs. We've got two ECMs. And yeah, here we go. This is what I'm talking about. Logica going for the attack. But because the firebase is on a hill, it has slightly more range. At least I think that's how it works. And it actually managed to take out the new cannon here. So one thing that Logica could try and do is position the new cannon right here behind the supply crates. And that way, the firebase no way could hit it because, well, game logic. The <laughs> supply crates, although they're tiny, they're in the way, right? Anyway, we've got a carpet bomber coming in here. And, oh, look at this. We have the army of Malik pinned down, going right into the bombs. Oh, look at this play, ladies and gentlemen. Logica, you beast. Look at that. Poor Malik. Having his whole army taken out, eradicated. My god. Very nice here. Using the mind drop, using the carpet bomber. And right now, Malik is in a lot of trouble. Malik's still level 4. He doesn't have access to Leaflet. He doesn't have Moab. He doesn't have Spectre. He has A10, and that is it. If the A10s are on cooldown, this could be it for Malik. If Logica is fast, he will take him out, and that will be it. We still... Let's actually have a look here at Dominator. He's still building more hackers. He's got a nice amount. You know, he's got a nice amount. He's putting mines everywhere. In case of a potential sneak attack, but I think there are no more GLAs left. I think, uh, yeah, I think Chaka is the last GLA, and he, whoa, 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 Shay, easy there, Shay, easy, down, boy, down. <laughs> That's too many licks. <laughs> Chaka says GG and surrenders before Malik does, which means that Chaka right now is in the fifth position, giving him two points, same points as Rob. And Malik and now dying. Oh, wait, no, wait. These are actually Dominator's Lixes. Oh, look at that. These are Dominator's Lixes. Dominator denied the kill here for Shay. Shay does not get an extra kill. And look at this. Dominator now killing Malik. Oh, man. Very, very nasty. Look at this. Dominator actually leaving Malik alone and going straight for Logica here. He's actually not killing Malik. He's not killing Malik, but Malik right now has 1.8k. Oh, boys. Also, there's no dozer here. So does this count as Malik being defeated or not? We will have to consult the replay. This is not a clear case. Because... Since Malik has a command center, he can use general powers, but he can't use those general powers to do significant damage to someone. So as far as I know, Malik might just be defeated. Does he have... He's not collecting money either. He is not collecting money. We'll have to consult the replay for this. So yeah, that actually makes it a little bit difficult there. What do you know? Meanwhile, Logica is trying to go for the kill here. So, right, there was one drop zone of Malik that Logica now destroyed. So, we will have to sit down, boys. We'll have to get in our nice, comfy armchairs and decide what the fuck happened here. And whether Logica gets a point for killing Malik or whether M Malik is still considered to be alive at this stage. That is the question. So, here we go. First game. Already going to be very tough to grade the players. So I'm just going to leave Malik alive 
for now. He is technically mining. Te well, he, he could, right? He could. But we'll have to see. We'll have to consult. We'll have to see how the rest of the game continues as well. We have Dominator now trying to go for Logica. Logica saying GG and surrenders. Look at that. So now comes the question, does Malik... Malik surrenders right after Logica. We have to analyze this replay. I think we do, because does Malik actually count as being defeated after Logica? That is something we'll have to see. We will have to check it out. My guess from what was happening, I would say my vote from what I'm experiencing here, without checking replay, without going into depth, I would say that Malik was already defeated. He had nothing he could do. He was no threat to any other player. He was basically had. He, he couldn't mount an attack. He couldn't make a shocking change, do anything. Um, so my vote is that Malik dies now and that Logica dies after. That is what I can say. Um, but yes, we definitely have to check the replay here. Regardless, we are still going to play three games. So what's going to happen? I'll tell you guys what's going to happen. Um, after, this, uh, after this match, we'll continue the other two games. And then what we'll do is we'll spend some time analyzing the replay. Just to make sure that we delivered the points in a fair manner. Because this was a bit of a tricky situation happening here. But don't worry guys, we're all about fairness. Uh, we'll do it the right way. And here we go. Oh boys, I don't think Dominator's paying attention. Because I think that was an EMP. Did it get taken out? It dropped! It dropped! Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh my god, it dropped! Shay, you monster! Man! Taking out all the licks. Oh man! That was a blow. If this man had cash bounty, he'd be a millionaire now. Fuck me, man. That was an amazing EMP. Dominator could have tried to avoid that, but oh man, what a strike. What a strike. Let me just talk to Malik here. We'll have to analyze. But I think uh, Logica is place three. And Malik plays four. But it's not final. The replay will be uh, checked to verify. And also how it goes as regards points for the kills. So this is all the stuff that needs to be checked. So there's a lot of checking. There's going to be so much checking, guys. Oh my god. Anyway, doesn't matter. It's all part of it. And this is how we play. These are the rules. And the players are making use of the rules best they can. And uh, let's actually see here what's going to happen. Dominator in a bit of uh, doing a good job here. He actually, is that the dozer? Wait, why is there a dozer here? How did the dozer get there? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, man. Malik have CC and 3,000 money, said Rob. Yeah, see, this is the thing. It's going to start it becoming a whole debate thing. Guys, for all of you watching and for the people playing, of course, as well, they shouldn't be listening to the stream anyway. But um, don't worry, guys. We're going to sort this stuff out, and it'll, it's going to be all right. Okay, that's all I can assure you. It's going to be all right, and we're going to sort this out calmly, not live, not like, oh, we got to know an answer now, now, now. No, we're going to do it calmly. And look at that. Dominator winning with double the cash collected here over Logica. Very nice. Sitting back, being left alone the whole game, and he takes the first win. Congratulations! Dominator coming in at first place with Shay coming in at second place. So now we actually update the points. Uh, let's uh, do that. Oh shit. Everybody's in lobby. No. <laughs> Sorry, I need to update points. Need to update points. Okay. So, um, Let me just reassure the guys here. Let me let me do this so you guys can see what I am writing to everyone. We will check the replay to see how the points should be distributed. Um, so I won't do I won't announce the winners tonight. We'll have to check the replays. There, making it super duper clear, guys. Super duper fucking clear. 
Okay, so, um, that puts, in my opinion, uh, I would say that puts Logica in third place. But I'm gonna put a question mark, which gives him four points. Alright, so for all of you watching. And Malik is gonna be put in fourth place, which gives him... Wait, am I doing this right? No, Malik should get four points. Wait, give me a sec. Two, this one. Three, it's four. Four, it's three. Come here. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, I will. Give me, give me a minute. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. I'm doing the point tallying. Give me a minute, guys. What the hell? Okay, so Logica killed Rob, so he gets an extra point for that. Uh, Dommy killed Shay, so he gets an extra point for that. Shay did not kill Chaka, and Chaka didn't kill anyone, and Malik... Did Malik get killed by Logica? I guess so. I guess so. If we count, if we count that, then yes. So that, let me tally the points here, guys. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take a bit more, like, time and stuff to do the tallying this time, because last time, like, with the tournament, I did a bit of a rush tallying and as a result I made a mistake and that is pretty awful and I don't want to make any mistakes we're gonna do a nice smooth clean ship here so that puts Chaka with a total of two points and we have Dominator with a total of eight points we have Logica with a total of six points we have Rob a total of two points Shay has uh, five points is that correct yeah, that's correct. And Malik has a three points. There we go. Scores have been updated. And I think we are ready. Okay. Let's do it. Next game. All right. So this is the thing. These are the points for now, guys. They still have to be verified. So for those of you saying, oh, I don't think it's fair. Send me a message. If you want to check the replay, this is automatically uploaded on the... Uh, on Gen Tool, so you can download the replay right now if you like and check it out and uh, send me some messages say hey I think this guy should get the point because of this or I think this guy shouldn't get the point because of that Seriously, we listen to each and every one of you. You are each a very valued members. So yes uh, I see people saying he had a drop zone and 3,000 and a barracks says Sipan. Yes, that is correct He did have all that but there is one important thing and that is the rules. The rules specifically state that a player needs to be strong enough to at least hurt someone. Like, seriously, hurt them. You don't have to kill them, but you have to be able to hurt them. And at that point, what Malik had left couldn't hurt shit. It couldn't hurt Shay. It couldn't hurt Logica. Uh, there was just no real way that he was going to be able to do anything. But again, this is what I'm just seeing from here, from now. This has to be investigated. This will be investigated. So these, these scores you see up here are not finalized, okay? That's just it. So let's take a nice breath and... <sighs> All right, let's continue. Um, I see, unfortunately, I see a message here from uh, Sniper. He actually came online and he said, Sorry, man, I was asleep. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> feels bad, man, feels bad. But, uh, yeah. Uh, pity, man. Okay, Malik says he's coming. Yes, we're still waiting on Malik. So, uh, yeah, I, I do want to say F for respect for, for Sniper. Unfortunately, he, he overslept. So, <laughs> feels bad, man. Mm. Anyway, guys, again, I'm going to say this one more time. The scores are not final. If you disagree, don't say it in the live chat. Message me on Discord and give the points, timestamps I need, of the replay where you think things are fair or not fair. All right, so the next match we are doing will be on Instant Shock Arena. Yeah. You know, just for a little uh, variation, you know, like make it nice and interesting. Okay, and we have... <laughs> oh, boys. Ooh. Interesting armies there. Interesting armies. I always wait just to make sure there's no slow load. And uh, it doesn't look like there will be. And we have Dominator again as infantry in the red here. We've got a beacon thrown down. <laughs> Logic is saying I've lost already. Yeah, normal China is a bit of a bitch. We're gonna get another message. Let's see. What's he gonna say? Malik will attack me. Malik will attack you. Why does he say Malik will attack you? Malik's not next to you, man. 
No, instead we have Chaka to your side. We have Dominator below you, but Chaka to the side here. Chaka in yellow as super weapon. An advantage that Chaka has is with the pro rules rules, Chaka is allowed to build a particle cannon. So that might be helpful. Raging Shay! The almighty demolition general here in blue. That is gonna... Oh my god, that is so... Oh, fuck, man. This guy's gonna go crazy. I'm sure he's happy as fuck right now being demo. Because it's such a good army to have in free-for-all. Because of the demo scuds. And uh, let's see what's gonna happen. We got Rob here. Rob is... What is Rob? Rob is super weapon general as well. So he also gets access to particle cannon. And we have a USA laser here, Malik. So Malik laser again. So, uh... We actually only have one GLA. Why slow game? Yeah. Let's see, is it going slow? Yeah, it is going a bit slow here. Just a bit. Latency is not too bad, but there is a bit of a slowness in the FPS here. And uh, we see Chaka, he has, uh, he's going for his war factory here. He's going for all the oils he can. And uh, Logica actually paying attention here and actually takes out this dozer. Yeah, Chaka forced to retreat here. Dozer is in a bit of trouble. No, he's continuing the build. Bit risky. He might just lose this Dozer. He sold the command center, so that might be Chaka just on one Dozer. And no, Chaka saves it just in time. Very nice. Ranger here gunning down the tank hunter. Is Dozer going to be all right? Oh, is he paying attention? Oh, is he paying attention? Oh, man, he might TNT this. This might be a bit of a blow here. Yeah, he's paying attention, but... Okay, yeah, probably Tank Hunter will go down. Let's go on to the middle. We have Mr. Malik trying to go for the middle here. He's got oils. Everyone's got oils. Everyone wants the oils. Loads of USA. So we have a nice drop here from Rob saying, bitch, the oil's mine. Going nice and fast. We've got Shay getting the extra supply here. Uh, whereas not going for this one here. That is an interesting choice. Probably because a lot of players focus too much on getting the supply close to them. So how the map is divided is you have one supply that you share with one enemy. And then with the other enemy, you share just a tower. You know, just a casual tower. You know, nice tower. So that's basically the thing. Shay didn't go for this because he thought it would lure yellow. So he went straight here. Put some tunnel networks down and he feels a lot safer. It's further away from the other enemies. So he'll be left alone. Meanwhile, we see Logica attempting to do a rush here on Dominator. And it doesn't quite work out. Okay. When dragon tanks just go full freaking stupid. Ugh. Why they do this? Anyway, it seems like there was a bit of a battle going on here. So Dominator and Logica seem to be fighting quite nicely. I hear another oil cap coming through here. This time for Chaka. Is Rob going to intercept just in time? Doesn't look like it. Nope. Rob's not going to intercept. That being said, Rob already does have this oil. And he doesn't have this oil yet. And, yeah, that's it. So, Rob kind of needs the oils. Shay. Shay seems to be in a good position here. He's just calmly calmly expanding. Calmly growing, you know. Dominator going for a bit more aggressive build. Trying to get the middle supply as well. Now, these middle supplies, they only have 15k. Right? So, that is half the amount of money from your normal base supply. So, these... Um, these won't mine for very long in comparison. Meanwhile, we see a nice attack here from Logica. He's keeping up the pressure. He cleared the garrison here, so it's clear. Logica wants to be nice and annoying to Dominator. He's not allowing Dominator to do what he did last time, which was just build up hackers, sit back, and then eventually go and attack. Let's see what is happening here. We have Chaka. Chaka doesn't have this oil, and he is collecting with two Shinooks. He does have his base oil. But that is it. No, he's got this oil too. So Chaka's in an okay position. See, the thing is, Shay has one problem. And that is that he's in between two USAs. And the thing is, a USA gets really powerful when they have three Humvees and like two ambulances and search and destroy. So when this strat center goes up and reaches 100%, Shay might be in some trouble here. Got a beacon coming. Why is there a beacon? Is he gonna, is he gonna write a message? No, no message today. Oh, well. And here we go. Shay knows this. Shay knows that he has to make sure that the USAs don't get too strong. So, Shay is going and attacking Rob. Meanwhile, we actually get Chaka. Look at this. Chaka coming in here from the side. Sneaking past this little bunker and actually doing a lot of damage here to Mr. Logica. Look at that. Logica in serious trouble now. He still has two dozers. This one's probably going to go down. That's one do- No, it's still alive. Dozer's alive. And the Humvee killed itself. The Humvee parked too close to the war factory. And the splash damage of the missile defenders actually made the Humvee kill itself. Oh, and these things happen. 
Oh, zero hour things, guys. Just zero hour things. Meanwhile, we do have just one GAT. It's not really going to be enough to take out such a scary looking Humvee. Uh, we have a load of tank hunters in the scene as well. And uh, Logic are having a bit of a hard time here. He's being under attack. And also Rob having a bit of a hard time. Rob being rushed. These players, they know Rob's style. They know that if you rush Rob, you have a chance of taking him out. Because if Rob gets to the late game, he is near impossible to kill. He'll have so much money, and he's just so good. He will just fuck you all, seriously, like crazy. Meanwhile, we do have 70% here on the strat center, and Rob can complete this. Dummy, I don't think you want. Dummy, I don't think you want what? Oil. Okay. <laughs> what? Malik saying, don't take the oil. I saved you last game. Chill. Here we go. Diplomacy is happening, boys. Dominator wants the money. He wants the oil. Meanwhile, we still see Chaka harassing Logica here. And Logica having a bit of a hard time. Humvee is low health now. And looks like he's going to be backed into a corner. So that Humvee probably will go down. We have some reinforcements en route. But... Yeah, there we go. There goes the last Humvee. Oh, actually, it just about survives. Very nice. Logica does still have two dozers, does have a bunker and a gat cannon, a bunker here and this manned. So it's going to be a bit hard for Dominator to engage this. He will need ECMs. And there we go, he's getting the prop now to get ECM access. Uh, that being said, this is a bit annoying for Logica. He has to take this out. Um, he's still only level one. All players are still level one. Logica is probably very close to reaching level two. And when Logica hits level three, he'll be real dangerous because he can just carpet. Uh, an army, he can do mind drop, and that is one advantage that normal China has. They have great general powers quite early on. Uh, Shea going for the attack, doing more kills, and Strat Center's been taken out. The base is pretty much exposed here. No income from uh, for Rob. Rob losing the oil as well, and Last Dozer coming in here, now being taken out, and Shea sees his first victim of the day, and it is Rob. Is that Rob Dozer hunted? It appears so. And Rob has absolutely no way of having income. He still has 3,000 cash. So he could build a bit of an army. Shay not even giving a shit about killing this. He's just building a supply stash saying, fuck it, that money's mine. And uh, that probably will be Rob out. Meanwhile, we see Malik being a bit aggressive here to Dominator. Malik did say, don't take that oil. And here we go, we have an attack happening. So, ironically, even though Dominator and Logica sought to kill each other, both their neighbors said, Hey guys, how about no? <laughs> oh, great stuff. We got Strat Center being built now for yellow. It would very much help him to get a particle cannon as well. The only problem with getting a particle cannon early on, um, as a super weapon general, is you'll have the particle cannon thing showing in the corner. And that will draw attention, and people might just attack you. In fact, actually, it looks like Chaka's under a bit of... Uh, in a bit of trouble here because we've got the counter push, we've got troop crawler here. Do we see the red guard vetted? No, we do not. He's saving the general powers for later. Rob calling the GG and Shay claims the first victim of the match, which is Rob, who's coming in in sixth place again. Poor Rob. It hurts. <laughs> so Rob right now on a total of only four points. Shay gets an extra point for taking out Rob. And let's see how this match will continue. Actually, I look away for a second and I see that uh, Chaka cleaned this up very nicely. Very well done, because that was a big infantry blob. That's a bit difficult for you, say, to deal with. So we had uh, two Humvees or three Humvees and an EMP. And um, Logica doesn't give a shit. He's just going to keep attacking and keep pushing. Meanwhile, let's see what happened here. Was this just a flexing of muscles? It seems so. It seems that Malik has returned to his base and uh, Gat Cannon being built here. And that is the first money plane, isn't it? Yeah, look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Malik going for the eco. Check it out. That is one, two, three, four, five. Let's count it for the hell of it. Man, get the fucking upgrade. Ah! Oh, seriously. Why you do this? Anyway, let's actually look at Shay, shall we? I haven't looked at him in a while. He's building his command center. He's got one market, two, three. And uh, Shay looking very, very shiny right now. Mm, very nice. Got two arms dealers building buggies. And uh, he's looking for his next victim. He knows that he'll probably want to take out Malik or Chaka. But Chaka is actually quite busy with Logica here. Logica is still level 1. But he is building command center. He's uh, starting to worry he might get dozer hunted. 
And uh, we got MIGs. MIGs. Yeah, good call. Okay, so we got Black Napalm. You only need two MIGs with Black Napalm to take out a Humvee. And the splash damage might let you take out a blob of Humvees. So that's very nice. No MIG armor yet. I always like seeing MIG armor. I hope he's gonna get it. This is logical. I'll probably get it soon. And here we go. Second MIG up in the air. Is he gonna go for a strike right away? He doesn't have much scouting. And we have the first Tomahawk coming out of Chaka here. Causing some harassment, essentially being a ticking time bomb, saying, Logica, if you do nothing, this guy's just gonna eat all the defenses. Alright, let's see, we've got Malik with the uh, same nice big army here. Just driving around. Maybe he's trying to find some kills. Got an airfield here that seems to be empty from Dominator. And internet center being built right next to the oil. Uh, don't know if that's a great idea, buddy. You're just asking for like an A-10 strike with a Spectre and then you lose the oil and your hackers. But, you know, it's it's a free country. You know, you can, you can build it there. It's all right. So, yes, we see some harassment here going on Dominator's middle area. Like I said before, there's only 15k in these, so this is already mined out. Shay already mined this out too, and now they're kind of like long distance mining this one. And, um, yeah, one Humvee got taken out here. And uh, Malak just trying to get some kills. Right now, the only person who's level 3 is Mr. Shay. And uh, he's, uh, he's bunkering quite nicely. I think that Shay is playing this one by the books. He's getting the extra money from the enemy he defeated. He got the extra oil, extra secured, and uh, the oil here. And now he'll just spam markets. And then later, guys, mark my words, he's going to spam arms dealers. And they will pump out scuds, quads, buggies. And he'll just take over whoever he wants to take over. He'll just kill everything. China's won't be able to stop him, and even the USA's won't be able to stop him. Meanwhile, we do still see engagements happening here. So Chaka actually managed to destroy everything here that belonged to Logica. So that's a good job by him there. Uh, Logica is not really that well off, if you look at it. He doesn't have that much money. He's got one oil and another oil. So he's got two oils and this. How much money is left here? 10k. Only 10k. And then this is mined out. We have no hackers on the scene here. Uh, let's look at Dominator. He's pumping out hackers. Look at that. We've got three barracks here. And this one... No, this one's building tank hunters. And it looks like Dominator might do a repeat of last game strategy. Just get a shit ton of Lixes and go for it. Malik also getting a good amount of drop zones here. So all the players seem to be going for the late game. Apart from Chaka and Logica. Which probably will bite them. Okay, we've got another MIG strike happening. Trying to take out the little annoying bunker. Which... Actually, the building itself survived. Look at that. No, it goes down. Okay, it goes down. It goes down. So that's one problem solved for Logica. He now has a more open way of attacking. Uh, still no particle cannon for Chaka. This. Oh, boys. Oh, Chaka's going to regret this. When Logica hits level 3, and he's level 2 right now, this is where the Carpet Bomb and Arty are going to go. And he's going to lose all these three buildings here. Very high profile targets. And when these go, it's going to be a big ouchie for Chaka. But let's see, Chaka doing very well so far. Normal China, not having that much. Um, we have another MiG being built, but there is an Avenger present, so it's a bit difficult for Logica to engage this. Uh, we have more stuff being built here by Shay. Look at this, he's going full Sim City here. That's how you do it, boys. That's how you do it. Look at this, he's got this oil completely secure, loads of tunnels here. He's got this oil secure, he's got this oil, that's three, four oils. So, Shea on four oils, nothing in the middle though, and uh, loads of markets being spammed. Malik also trying to do the same, trying to keep up, but um, essentially there's going to be a bit of a problem here between Malik and Dominator. If Malik keeps trying to attack Dominator, um, and vice versa, these guys are going to let Shea get too big, and then it's going to be over for everyone. Shea will just like stampede through this game and just kill everyone in his path he'll hit level five to sneak attack and just kill whoever all right so we actually have chaka who managed to sneak in a nice humvee migs are ready take it out very good response and ambo just kind of i don't know chilling oh wait actually two missile defenders are alive he might be able to laser lock these migs and do further damage here uh meanwhile we do have a few humvees and oh look at this oh man these things are so annoying the chinook might Oh, is it? Yeah, Shinnok goes down. Oh, nice, man. Logica paying attention, taking out a Shinnok like that. That being said, though, Shaka now has this EMP that's going to be built to make sure that won't happen again. Uh, Logica really having a hard time. He needs to hit that level 3 so he can call in the carpet bomber and start seriously harassing Yellow. 
Yellow right now is doing a very good job. And we have... Oh, look at this. Dominator actually dropping off infantry to try and take out Logica. Preventing Chaka from getting the point as well. Very sneaky, sneaky. Logica has pretty much nothing at this point. It's got two oils. And that is pretty much it. It looks like Logica won't last for much longer. And look at Shay, guys. Look at Shay. Shay's had enough. He's going for the attack. He's got a Jarman buggies. He's even sending workers. This is how you know that Shay is confident. When he sends workers in his attack force, he's like, Oh, let's build a tunnel, you know, because why the fuck not? And in fact, very poorly defended here by Malik. Just one firebase. Malik now having to get his whole army down. And Malik actually... What happened to all his Humvees? Were they taken out by th these new cannons? We've got a couple Humvees here. The fast sell coming out on all these buildings. Malik wants to get some of that money back that he invested in all these drop zones. And he doesn't want Shay to get the XP. Shay is already level 3. And it looks like he's going to be the first one to hit level 5 at this rate. Malik has to be very careful. But there's not much he can do to stop this. What he really needs is like 6 Avengers and like 10 laser tanks. And then a few ambulances and maybe Pathfinders. But Malik still being level 1. Forget it buddy. There's nothing that he can do to stop this. Quads and buggies. Very lethal combination. We see an RT barrage being called in from uh, Dominator here. And it looks like it might go for the oil. Don't tell me he's going to send it on the oil. He can capture that oil. In fact, Logic is even destroying the oil to make sure Dominator's not going to get it. Unless he's going to try and take out just this. That, that, would be, that would be awesome. Let's have a look at that. But yeah, look at that. Logica now being 2v1 and taken out by Yellow and Dominator. And he will surely be the first to die now. And yes, look at this. Oh, the RT. Trying to keep the oil alive. Oh, nice one here from Dominator. Very well played. And I think that is it for Logica, boys. Logica coming in at fifth place. Giving him an extra two points. There is absolutely nothing he can do here. He's calling in the last carpet bomber just to make life a little more difficult for Dominator. And uh, there's a minigunner in here. And minigunners do great damage against air units. And does good damage to the bomber. But the bomber does survive. It's uh, just a guessing, I think. I don't think Logica knew what Dominator's base looked like. Just wanted to do some damage. Took out the barracks, took out the supply center. And we're probably going to see the GG now from Logica. That being said, though, Malik is in serious trouble here. Look at Shay. Shay engaging. Logica calling the GG, and that is it. So because Dominator got involved, Chaka does not get the extra point for killing him. Right now, Dominator is speaking with Yellow, saying, take the supplies. It's yours. He's trying to do some diplomacy here. Chaka saying thank you. But yes, I can already foresee what's going to happen. Dominator and Chaka are going to have to work together to take out this giant evil that is Shay. Shay is so fucking strong right now. Whoa, blue, 100 markets. Yeah, it looks like spy satellite number two just kicked in for Dominator. He's realizing what he's up against. He realizes he needs to save um, Shay here. Oh, boys. Oh, boys. Let's see, do we see any Scud launchers? Not yet. Scud launchers would be great to deal with infantry general. Because Scud launchers cannot be stopped unless there's an Avenger present. And only yellow can build Avengers. Wait, let me just reassure Logica. Huh? Alright, and here we have Shay just hammering through the base. Look at this. Shay is level 5, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, man. Oh, Shay is gonna do it, man. Shay is gonna do it. He's gonna kill everyone. I'm surprised he hasn't stolen any armies. That is what I'm honestly surprised about, because Shay likes doing those things as well. Like he would steal, I don't know, a super weapon general just to get search and destroy. And the Dominator trying to use some diplomacy, saying, oh my god, he's going to do sneak attack and GG. And Shay actually, what's he doing? Where's he going with his army? I think he's realizing that Dominator's coming in for an attack. Is that it? Mind you, Shay does have good production here. We've got one, two, three arms dealers. He's building a fourth one. 
And yes, we have loads. Oh, yes, here we go. In fact, Shea stole a command center here from Yellow. Look at this. We have the USA command center being built. And this is what I'm talking about. Shea likes doing these things because they help so much. If he gets search and destroy, then it will affect even his GLA units. And that means when their scud launchers come, they will fucking wreak havoc because they'll have an extra 20% range and they can even outrange new cannons, no problem at all. And even the quads will get the range boost and the buggies. So very, very good choice there by Shea. I was wondering like, hmm, why doesn't he do it? But there you go, he does it. Unless he stole laser, which would be even more lethal. If he stole laser, we'll have a look in a sec. I'm very curious now. If he stole laser, it's GG. Oh man, it's GG. It's fucking GG. So for those of you who like free-for-all, but you don't like get that involved, the strongest land army you can have in the game is probably combining laser tank with demo general because demo general you can get the scuds and then you just get laser tank army with avengers with ambulances back it up with just a few buggies and a good amount of scuds and nothing can stop you absolutely nothing only things like a moab and and those kind of general powers that's what can do something to stop it but honestly <laughs> if if shay utilizes this to the max it's it's gg like beyond fucking recognition guys these guys need to work together they need to work together now because shay is gonna fucking take the game here we go, loads of quads. Very risky to send in the Lixes, but I understand. Dominator doesn't have a choice. One Lix goes down, another one managed to do an evac, actually. That was a very good fast evac. And the other Lix does also go down. Sneak attack is still alive. We might see more units coming out, but maybe, maybe just maybe, this was just a little bit of a scare tactic saying, Dominator, I'm coming for you, baby. I'm coming for you, and you can't stop me. <laughs> oh shit, man, look at this. Shay on fire, just eating through everyone here. My god. I want to I wanna see some USA scaffolds here of War Factories. We see Yellow actually trying to do a bit of attacking as well. Uh, isn't Domi in the lead with the points? Well, not for long. <laughs> oh, man. We got power being built here. Shea is now realizing and he's starting to pay attention to his USA side of life. And uh, we're probably going to see some, oh, some, some fucking laser tanks, man. I love laser tanks. They're fucking amazing. Laser tanks backed up by quads. Glorious shit. Malek gets taken out here. My god, very well played by Shay. Gets another point for taking out Malek. Fuck. So that puts Malek at the fourth position, giving him three points. Oh, boys. Here we see Shay choosing not to engage infantry at this point. Man, guys, Shay is on fire. Look at that. When I saw that the guy was Demo General, I just knew it, man. I just knew it. Fuck. I see Nickname saying Shay should get Super Weapon as well so he can get two strategy centers. Yes, that is correct. You can do that and they can stack, but only in certain situations. If you get two strategy centers, the first strategy center must be put to Bombardment and the second strategy center must be put to Search and Destroy. And if you do it in that order, both of them will count. If you do it in reverse order, it won't work. All right, it won't work. Junity did a video on this. Really good video. You should check it out. Um, yeah, let's actually see. Um, Logica brings up a fair point. Who is Shay going to kill first? Is Shay going to kill yellow first or red? Because the thing is this, guys. I, I really suspect that um, since Shay, being a great player that he is, he has the, the possibility of having the best land army in the game probably should be able to take out whoever he chooses at this point. Dominator does have a lot of income though. He does have a good amount of hackers. They are blobbed up here, which is maybe not the best because you can hear them. Even though they're stealth, you can hear them. Look, maybe I can show you guys. You know, you hear the wee, wee, you know. Oh, so cute. Anyway, so you can hear it. So if uh, Search and Destroy pops up for Shay and he presses USA intelligence and just listens carefully on his headphones and goes around and then he hears only the sound over here he can just do a scan with the USA command center and he'll see all these hackers here and then he might I don't know drop an anthrax bomb here it might just happen and let's see what's gonna happen here now Shay is uh, choosing where to attack we got these new cannons who are really dangerous got mines here very well defended and set up here from Dominator and Logic is, is makes sense to eliminate all GLAs. Yes, they were left alone. Well, I mean, there's only one GLA here and he was left alone. And this is the thing, Shay tends to be left alone. People don't realize how fast and how big he gets 
and uh, they just worry too much about the guy next to them rushing, so they decide to rush. And, uh, uh, but Shay actually has this secret weapon where he tends to go a bit risky in the early game, and then uh, he, he will already be quite strong in the mid game. He'll kill a player, exactly like what he did here with Rob, and then he'll just build up like crazy, and then he just becomes unstoppable. It's a very good tactic to use in free-for-all. Very well executed. Like I said, he's playing by the book here, and uh, even with this army, um, he's doing good damage. He's really doing good damage. And Dominator is hanging on, and Dominator is getting XP. In fact, he's level 4 now, which is very good. That's a lot of, that's a lot of general powers he has access to. When he gets level 5, he needs to have 5,000 XP. Um, he can actually call in EMP, which will help again. And here we go. Chaka actually coming in, trying to help out Dominator just a bit, but not microing his units and losing all three Vs here, probably. Yeah. A bit of a waste. He did kill a bit, and more than anything, he distracted Shay, which will give um, Dominator a bit more of a chance to defend himself. But Shay is ready, boys. Shay is ready. He's got another army here. We got War Factory, and we got the Strat now starting. Strat is underway. We see no scaffolds here. Oh, man, please build a fucking USA War Factory. Scud launchers hitting the scene. Oh, boys, this is what I'm talking about. We've got AP rockets as well, which also affects the Scud launchers, so they're even more powerful. I know it doesn't show the, the icon, but it affects it. Don't worry, guys. It really does. And where is that sneak attack? Here we go. A nice sneak attack to reinforce an army. Shea wants to attack from this side. The question is, will he wait for the strat center to finish or not? Got an Arty Barrage coming in from Dominator, probably right here to prevent that sneak attack from uh, sending out more units. Shea probably knows what's up, but Shea also has a tunnel here. He doesn't need the sneak attack as such, but I guess in a way it's a good way to also bait um, an artillery barrage out of Dominator. Meanwhile, we have um, nice supply drop zones here from Chaka. No particle cannon yet. At this point, Chaka needs to get a particle cannon. He's super weapon general. He's allowed to build one particle cannon in pro rules. And it's clear. It's clear that it's going to be Dominator and Chaka versus Shea until the end. That is what's going to happen. And the RT actually strikes here. In front of the sneak attack. Um, okay. And here we go, boys. Listen for that search and destroy. It's not a coincidence that right now we see some scuds popping out. Do we see MIGs on the scene? We see no MIGs. So no way that these scuds can be taken out with ease. Bit of a miss micro here, sending in those quads. Strat center is completed. Search and destroy coming through here. We've got search and destroy fucking demo scuds. He has search and destroy scuds, says Dominator. Lol. Look at these babies. Look at them go. Just taking out those outposts, no problem. All Shay needs right now is a bit of a, a proper ground army to defend these scuds, and that will be it. They'll be fucked. And this is what I'm talking about. This is what I wanted to see. I wanted to see USA War Factories, and I still don't see any. Man, just throw in some Avengers. He's building Ambos. I like that. Ambos are great. They actually heal your units, so even if you have Junk Repair, which Shay has, if you have an Ambo next to it, it will actually stack and heal a little faster. And there we go. I got to go three minutes. Have fun. Dommy surrenders. Wow, look at that. So, Dominator actually coming in uh, third place here. Giving him four points. And this counts as another kill for Shea. And right now, I think it's quite clear. Yellow is in trouble. Okay, Dominator says, be right back in three minutes. And let's see what's going to happen here. If there was a particle cannon ready, Chaka could have done just a little bit more damage. But Chaka, seeing how he's still level 4, he needs to be that level 5. That being said, though, yeah, look at that. He's, he's still, he still needs 2,000 XP. GG, well played. And Shea takes the game. When I saw Shea as demo, I was like, man, this is it, boys. <laughs> this is it. Oh, Shea gets a load of points. Oh, my God. He killed four players. He killed Rob, he killed uh, Chaka, he killed Malik, and he killed Dominator. That's unbelievable. And coming in at first place, giving him loads of points here. Boys and girls, we need to do some tallying here. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. So that brings the points up to uh, Chaka is second place. Five points, bringing Chaka to seven points total. Dominator is at 12 points total. 
because he didn't kill anyone. He helped kill Logica, but that was a 2v1. Uh, we have Logica coming in at 8 points. And Rob, 4 points. Shay has 1, 2, 3, 4, plus 7 is 11, plus 5, 16 points. And Malik coming fourth place, got him three points, so he's in total six points. So let's go and update the scores, guys. My God, my God, that was that was a match. And there you go, guys. The dangers of demo. I've had some people before tell me, oh, it's not fair that in pro rules you limit demo gen uh, general to not even have the uh, the demo upgrade. It's not fair. People have told me, and I say, no, no, demo when used correctly is fucking lethal and you guys witnessed that today so i'm gonna update the points here oh man oh man i still feel bad for rob though rob is a really good player and he's only on four points because he keeps getting rushed <laughs> oh man and malik at six points look at that amazing All right, man. Oh, that was some fucking GGs there. Anyway, pro killer, be nice. All right, be nice. Everybody be nice. Gotta be nice. Otherwise, I get mad. You don't like me when I'm mad. No, no. Oh, man. I'm gonna take a drink here. I'm just gonna, like, ah, oh, relax a bit. But this is the thing, guys. GLA is just so fucking powerful. In a map where you leave GLA alone, they're gonna get big. They're gonna become a problem. Um, oh, right. What are the standings? Uh, Chaka 7. Dominator 12. Logica 8. Rob 4. Shea 16. Malik 6. <laughs> I'm sure someone's gonna go like, what the fuck? Shea 16? <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah, guys, seriously, in the last match, Shay came first place, so he gets seven points. And then he killed four people. So he got 11 points. In the game before, so Shay, Dommy, and me. Uh, well, yeah, and, and, and Chaka. All right, so Dominator's ready. Let's go for the next game. Alright, last game, here we go, it's gonna be on DEFCON. Okay, let's do this. Here we go. The final game here on DEFCON. And uh, guys, don't, don't worry about the scores too much. Like I said, if you see anything that you disagree with, um, just tell me on Discord. You guys all have me on Discord. You all have me on Discord. I know you do. Yeah, you do. If you don't, join Discord. It's a great place. That is bit.ly slash CNC Discord, I think. The link is somewhere. Just look for it, like description or something. Yes, I'm lazy, okay? Figure, figure it out. <laughs> all right, so they're actually calculating the, the, the scores here. I like this. But yeah, if you spot something that you don't like in this match, send me the replay and tell me the timestamps, when to look, what you see, what's not right, and why someone should get a point or why someone should not get a point. We are not going to declare the winners tonight because of the things that have been happening. Um, but don't worry, the winners will get their money and I will probably announce it on my um, on my page, like the, the YouTube channel community page thing, or Facebook or Discord or Twitter and all the above, whatever, I'll see. Anyway, let's actually have a look at the armies. We have Malik as tank general. Oh man, he's gonna have to win this to uh, to get close here. And uh, nuke general here for Chaka. Nuke general actually is not a bad general to have in free for all. You can do some good damage, and like we saw in the first game, uh, Logica was doing very well. Uh, we have Shea here as super weapon general in the green, and we have. Rob, what was Rob? Rob was laser. Ooh, laser is actually pretty good. Logica says Rob peace. Interesting. Uh, Rob agrees. 
And Logica here, as super weapon in the blue, now doesn't have to worry about Rob, or will he? Rob can still backstab, those things sometimes do happen. And we have Dominator as Tox in general, I'm sure he's very happy about that. Uh, Dominator always uh, gets annoyed when he has the, the middle spots, so right now he's Tox in general, a good general to have in a corner spot, and that's one of the bigger corner spots, I think. Um, I don't know which one's the smaller one. I think this one's smaller? I don't know. But it's a good corner spot, so I'm sure he's happy. He's getting a fast arms dealer here. Uh, is this a fake one? It might be a fake one. It's building quite... Yeah, no, I think it, it might be real. It might be real, because as an observer, you can't actually tell. Um, so, yeah, that, that kind of sucks. In the replay, you could, but as observer, you can't. Meanwhile, we do still see Logica build an EMP, though. So, EMP... Uh, so, so, Logica is not fully relying on Rob's word here. Um... And in fact, Rob is doing the exact opposite. He's building a defense against uh, Shay here. Meanwhile, we have no one going for the middle here. Uh, I also like how the, the armies are somewhat balanced. We've got three USAs, we've got two China and one GLA, right? Nice balance-ish, sort of. And uh, yeah, we've got two super weapons. We've got fast oil here coming out of Logica. And uh, let's see, is Chaka going to go for a rush or for defense? He's trying to get these supplies here. It's probably a good call because it's easy for him to take them. And uh, to my surprise, Shay is not selling his command center. That is an interesting move. We see a Humvee coming out. It's got units inside. And there we go. He sees Rob's laser patriot and it deters him. And this is what Rob does. He makes one quick base defense and then people go, you know what, I'll rush the other guy, you know? And then problem solved. That's what Rob does. He's very good at it. And since he has peace with Logica, it might be that Rob is gonna be able to take this game. Because if Rob is gonna be left alone, he becomes very dangerous. And we might see him pull some of that late game shenanigans where he has like 50 war factories pumping out units. The whole fucking map has gone pink. And uh, crazy shit like that. But let's see. Rob's been having a hard time. Like, right now, Rob is on how many points? Four points? Oh, man. Yeah, four points. Feels bad, man. So, Rob has to win this. <laughs> Essentially killing everyone to uh, really stand a chance of winning some of that nice money. Which, of course, is being sponsored by AKA Baloney. Thanks very much for sponsoring this, man. Uh, it's a total of $150 prize pool. Winner takes home $100. Second place will get uh, $35 and third place gets $15. So very nice. Dominator building more defenses here. He's trying to repeat the first game he did where he was left alone as well, built a load of defenses and uh, essentially just got big and then won. Meanwhile, we do see a bunch of technicals here and they have units inside. So we might see Dominator go for an attack. The question is on who? Domi bottom right says Logica. EMP Patriot is here. There is a bit of lag and one of the... No, two of the techs get disabled. This is a bit of a blow for Dominator because now Logica can come in and clean up this little mess of troops. And how's the micro here from Logica's end? Humvee survives just a... Wow, that was very well done here by Logica. And takes out a lot of the army without losing anything. This might be a bit of a blow for Dominator. He's got another few techs and more RPGs at the ready. So Dominator is building a load of tunnels and he's trying to man up a nice army and then probably go for Logica. But let's have a look over here. What's happening between Malik and Chaka? We have some mild disturbances where both players want to mine from the, uh, this little trench and want to be left alone. Uh, we actually have Shay here also looking for an opening. Shay is fed up. Look at this. He wants to engage. And oh, actually, he finds an opening. Shay got flashbangs and now cleared the bunker. Oh, boys, this could be very lethal and very dangerous. Shay might evac and take this bunker for himself. But no, Shay returns to safety. Kills a battle master. Very good micro there. Humvee's still alive. And right now, Chaka is in a bit of trouble. And no, actually, Shay preemptively destroying the bunker just to make sure that nothing happens here to his little Vs. And the bunker's still technically alive. And Shay going for the power. Meanwhile, we have GLA in some trouble here. Mr. Dominator, are you ready to take on three Humvees? Are they all full? They have units inside, all of them. And right now, it's very difficult for Dominator. Oh, boys. Logica wants to go for the attack. It's clear. These two, they want to fight each other. They want to kill each other. And when USA gets a search and destroy, it has an advantage, guys. It has a fucking advantage. GLA really has a hard time, but look at the number of techs. Dominator investing all his money in all these techs. And look at this, they're getting stuck. And Logica making use of that. And does he actually get any kills? He gets one down, just like that, for free. That's 600, because the techs are more expensive for Toxin. 
And here we go. He's engaging the middle now. Logica's just looking around. He wants to know where can I attack, where can I do max damage, and losing nothing. Meanwhile, we have Rob engaging Mr. Shea here. Shea in some serious trouble. Look at that. Oh, man. Rob going for the kill. Rob is doing exactly what Shea did last game. You sit tight, you, bit, you get a nice army, and in the mid-game, you try and take someone out, take their money, and then get even bigger. Shea in some serious trouble here. That Humvee just about survives. No, it gets taken out. And this is very difficult for Shea to deal with right now. He needs perfect laser locks. He needs them to come out right on time. And, oh, Rob is paying attention. Does Rob have a follow-up army? He's got two Humvees here. Empty and empty. They're empty uh, Tovies. Let's see what's happening here real quick. We Look at this. Logica, all his Vs are still alive. All three of them. And Dominator just finding the right angle of attack here, but he can't seem to find it. Logica is constantly paying attention, making sure that Dominator can't easily engage these Humvees. Here we go. We might see it happening now. And Dominator going in. One Humvee taken out here. No, low health. Dominator manages to take it out, but look at the number of techs that have been going down. Is this financially viable for Dominator? Is this strat worth it? Look how many techs have been taken out just for killing one Humvee. And what about the XP? All these players are still level 1. Let's have another look here at Shea. Shea's still in trouble. Losing his units and stuff, man. He had to rebuild the power. Can't collect either. I think this is going to be GG for Mr. Shea, who right now is leading the charge with 17 points. Laser lock coming in. Not a good laser lock. More Humvees for reinforcement. And we actually see Chaka coming in here. Chaka retreating. Chaka retreating. Chaka does not continue to attack Shay. Come kill me, says Shay, because Shay knows that Rob <laughs> won't get the point. This is the thing. He won't get a point. There we go. Shay being a bastard, essentially luring uh, Yellow in. What is Rob going to do? Is Rob actually going to engage this army to try and make sure that he gets the point for killing Shay? And in fact, look how scary this army is. And look at this. Chaka actually taking out Rob. Oh, man. What this fuck is going on here? I love it. Fucking crazy. Look at that. Shay actually being defended by Chaka just so Chaka can take him out himself. Right now, that is Rob losing the point. That being said, though, Rob has pretty much killed Shay here. But the last income has been taken by Chaka. So even this, we'll have to check out who gets the kill here. Oh, man, the shenanigans. Meanwhile, we do see Dominator, who has cleared up these Humvees. We have one Humvee here. And this one, this tech, is going to go down. Let's see, Logica is level 2 right now. Dominator is still only level 1. Look at that. Logica has more than double the XP. And this is one of the dangers. When snipers come through, it's going to get more difficult. Particle cannon being built here from Logica. He's paying attention. And uh, here we go. Yellow trying to take this. Yellow had a Lotus here. Chaka had a Lotus. What happened to the Lotus? Did the Lotus get killed by the, the Rangers? Because the CC is alive. And I just wonder why. Okay, here we go. Shay is taken out. Wait, no. Shay has something. What does he have? He has one dose. <laughs> oh, I'm not dead yet. I have a scaffold. <laughs> Let's see. Shay doesn't have enough money to build anything. He has no money for building a supply center, so he's pretty much fucked here. Uh, meanwhile, let's have a look. Um, Rob is doing a very good job. He's level 3 already, and this is what I'm talking about. He's getting drop zones. Yeah! Let's have a quick look here at Malik. Haven't looked at him for a while. We've got internet center up. We've got a load of hackers being built. And it uh, looks like Malik wants to be a formidable enemy to whoever opposes him. And uh, look at this. Look at this fucking shit happening here. Oh, man. Yellow got a nice overlord army. And this, this is why Nuke is so powerful. You can easily set it up. You can easily get things going and moving. And Shea building a scaffold. But he doesn't have enough money, so what he needs to do is he needs to build a barracks, capture this, pray he gets enough money, then what, magically fly to the middle, build supply center. So, yeah, that is going to be a bit, of a, a bit of a tricky situation there. Let's see, meanwhile we have peaceful mining here between Malik and the Dominator. And we have Logica going for the engage. Humvee getting stuck. Humvee just about survives. Very nice. 
Jarman here from Dominator. I still want to see what the fuck Shay is going to do. This is just great. Is he just going to wait here? Yeah, he's just waiting. He's probably gone like to the grocery store now, and, you know, fetch some groceries. Like, hey, we're out of lettuce. I will go buy some lettuce. Bye. And then he'll just come back in half an hour. Everyone will have forgotten about him. And then he just, I don't know. We'll see, right? We'll see. Always good stuff. Here we go. Battle bus coming out of Dominator. Battle buses are very good for Toxin. That being said, though, we see none of the upgrades. Let's see. Yeah, none of the upgrades out of Dominator. So right now, these buses will do the same damage as a normal bus. You need to get Anthrax Gamma and get the AP Rockets upgrade. And then you actually have a total of, what was it? 60% additional damage for, uh, for the rockets. It's insane. But if he doesn't get these upgrades, these buses will be just as good as any other GLA bus. It won't do more damage or less. And uh, that often is like uh, something that people don't realize. Because you do see the tracers when um, when the rockets fire. You see the blue tracer, right? Of supposedly the anthrax. But uh, it actually is just, uh, it's just... It just looks cute. It doesn't actually do anything. You need to get the anthrax gamma upgrade. And here we go. Look at this. Rob under fire here. Now, if there's someone who can take out... Um, a nuke general with ease it will be the laser that being said though Rob doesn't have much of an army He's got two laser tanks. He needs a lot more laser tanks Maybe a few Avengers to help speed up the attack rate of the laser tanks. Maybe uh, a few ambulances as well and Oh dear. Oh dearie dear Rob. Where's your army Rob? You're level four throw some general powers at this. Come on, buddy What's this? What are you doing? Man Shay is dead. Forget about Shay. He's dead. You, you don't live by building a scaffold. Oh, I don't think Rob knows this. Rob is a great guy, but um, his English, sometimes he has a bit of trouble with it. So I don't think he realizes there's a rule that doing this shit doesn't make a difference. Okay, that is Shay dead anyway. So it makes it a little easier for me, I guess, right? So that actually puts Shay in sixth place, which gives him two points. And that means that Shay now has a total of 18 points. Which is still very high, guys. It's still very high. Got Spectre being called in from Logica. This is what I'm talking about. Logica hitting level 3. Now things are going to get a little more difficult for Dominator, who's already lost his oils by the looks of it to a Burton. Because that's like two little explosions there that a Burton would have done. And here we go. Going for the market. Logica playing this very well. He's denying income for Dominator, and if Dominator has no income, then Logica has no worries. In fact, Particle Cannon ready in 10 seconds. We got two drop zones out of Logica, third one underway, and we're gonna see this beauty fire very, very soon. Meanwhile, let's see, we actually have Rob clearing this up, sort of. We still have this army. Man, Rob, you're level four. Don't you have any general powers? I mean, I know your laser all you have is A10, but, oh man, feels bad. Anyway, so here we go. Particle Cannon striking. That was a market. Now going for the Palace. Very good target. So if you take out the Palace, that means no more Jarman Kell, no more bus production, and most importantly, Dominator can't build more black markets. And we actually see... What the hell? These guys aren't doing anything. They're not building. What the fuck? Does Dominator realize this? Oh, boys. Oh, boys. These guys aren't working. Ugh, they're on their smoking break. I always tell them to continue work. They never do. They never listen. And actually, this is a bit of a blow. Dominator needs to realize this because he needs the income. He really, really does. I don't think he's realizing. And right now, it looks like Logica is having a good time because that's the thing, guys. USA, when they get snipers, they have search and destroy. It's very difficult for, you, for GLA to engage it. The best way would be for uh, GLA to have buggies, but... Dominator went the route of buses. He did get the Anthrax Gamma upgrade and he didn't get the uh, AP Rockets upgrade, which is a bit of a... Wait, is Shay Obzing? Yeah, Shay. I'll tell Shay to go. And uh, so the thing is, he doesn't fully benefit from the weird OP upgrades. He needs to get this one as well to really benefit. So... Uh, the Anthrax Gamma on its own gives an extra 33% uh, attack damage to the missiles. So that is good that he got that first. It is also a bit cheaper. Um, but buses versus Humvees is not really a good way to go. Buses generally will start firing at the drones as opposed to the Humvees themselves. So it's very, very difficult to micro that. And you're much better off just getting a few rocket buggies and getting rocket buggy ammo. Here, still, look at this. So he cancelled this. 
Dominate to cancel this, probably to get some of the money. And these guys, finally he's building. Oh man. Dominator must be swearing now that he realized this. Oh man. Look at that. And here we go, Logica at the front door with the Humvees. Let's have a look at Rob. And Rob actually really in trouble here. Chaka taking this guy down. Look at this. He's got good overlords blocking the base here. Blue strong, says Dominator. Yeah, I don't think anyone's going to give a shit at this point. The only one who's actually in a position to do anything would be Malik. Malik looks like he's going to go for Chaka. Malik, because he is a bit afraid that this guy is going to get a load of new cannons and engage. And as tank general, you don't want to deal with a guy with a load of new cannons. In fact, even super weapon is a bit difficult to deal with. But new cannons? Yeah, that's, that's more difficult. And let's see. What's going to come out here? Is it an EMP? It's an EMP. Is it going to be followed up with a carpet bomber? We got a mine drop coming in here. And actually a few laser tanks have found their way here. I don't see a carpet bomber. That would be such a shame. This is so fucking carpet bomb ready. Oh man. And look at this. Command center has been taken out for Rob. Rob right now on one dozer. And somehow he has a collecting Chinook. He's collecting from here. And look at this. He actually sent his army all the way back to try and engage these guys. And he is managing Malik's army being destroyed. Malik the only guy who's still level 1 here. And the army is being taken out. Very well done. Very well played here from Yellow. Cleaning this up and having minimal losses. In fact, none of his base actually got attacked. Let's have a look. What does Rob have? Rob still has a Chinook and a load of Rangers. Was that a Strat Center? What was that? Barracks, I think he was trying to build. So the question is, what is Rob going to build? He's got 8k. Probably a good thing would be to go for a command center. There you go. He gets the general powers, which would be the A-10, uh, which is very good for taking out one strike, I mean, one group of units. And if he were to A-10 something like this, he would be insta level 5, which means he'll have access to leaflet, fuel air, and spectre. So that is very important. But right now, Chaka seems to have changed targets. He seems to be engaging um, Mr. Malik here. Now he's realizing that he probably should try and take out Rob. That probably would be the good call and Chaka being a bit indecisive. He's not sure if he wants to take out Malik. He's not sure if he wants to take out Rob. Meanwhile, we see a nasty little ranger drop happening here. Look at that. Capturing the oil, capturing the command center. There's an overlord here. If Chaka reacts in time, he can stop it. And losing command center is a big deal. And in fact, wait, how many dozers does Chaka have? Chaka has no dozers. Oh my God, don't tell me that Chaka has no dozers. Oh my god, no way. No fucking way, man. No fucking way. No fucking way. I don't see any dozers here from Chaka. No way. He had such a chance of winning this game. And he sold his CC, probably without realizing that he's without dozers. And just like that, he's dozer hunted. Rob going for an attack with a fucking Chinook drop and causing a lot more damage than he realized. Oh, boys. I really wonder what Chaka's gonna do now. Chaka can still take out Rob, get the points for that. And if Rob is out, that also secures him more points when he dies. Let's have a look what's going on here down south. We've got Logica clearing out all of Dominator. Dominator desperately trying to survive here. And um, Dominator has no income here, no oils. He doesn't seem to have any markets, and Dominator right now has no money either. And these Humvees are just ripping through him, and that will probably be Dominator out. Engaging Malik, an interesting choice, but I don't think that's going to work out too well. So, Chaka might be dozer hunted, but he still has a prop center, he still has hackers, he still has war factories. Chaka right now on 3.5k, he's still producing units. He could still take out Rob. Rob is still desperately trying to come back in this, and he's building supply drop zones. Rob is not dead yet, boys. Rob is not dead yet. But unfortunately for Dominator, he is dead. There is no way Dominator can come back here. Uh, the last worker probably here. And Dominator surrenders. Well played to Logica. Which means Dominator comes in at 4th place, right? Or is it 5th place? Let me have a look. 1, 2, 3, 4. Yeah, Dominator coming in 5th place. Giving him 2 points. 
bringing the total to 14. Dominator not killing anyone. Logica just killed Dominator, so he gets an extra point. Very well done. Now let's see what Logica is going to do. He's building more dozers. He wants to expand. He wants to build money. This is a very not good idea, in my opinion, building this all so close. We've got a particle cannon activating already. Where is it going to go? It's going on Malik. Going for the oils. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. In fact, right now, if Chaka continues fighting Rob, he can still get that point for killing Rob. Logica is choosing not to engage Rob. Arty Barrage over here from Malik, hoping to find an army, but the army is already moving on. He wants to kill Rob. Probably Chaka didn't realize how fast Rob would rebuild. And Rob, guys, he, he knows how to rebuild. This is what he does. And here we go. Look at this. Rob giving quite some issues here to these overlords. Chaka just about surviving, getting nice fit too there. And Rob again in serious trouble. Rob still uh, level 4, so it's not over yet. There is an A-10 strike, and right now this is fucking A-10 bait. Right here. If an A-10 can land here, that is the whole army gone. Insta level 5, and the rest can be cleared up with other general powers. Is Rob going to do that? Is Chaka paying attention? Chaka needs to take out the command center immediately to prevent a strike like that happening. Chaka does seem to spread his army, which is a good call. Rob escaping to the middle, hoping to find some peace and prosperity and set up a little hut and a little tent and make sure no one bothers him. But Chaka actually paying attention here. He's sending out an overlord to chase this one down. And will he find the other one over here in the middle? Or will Rob make a great escape? It looks like Rob is managing to get away in time. And again, command center destroyed. So it must have been on cooldown, the A-10s. And right now, Chaka again causing huge issues. We have just a Shinnok here from Rob. And Lotus trying to capture the last oil. Rob again trying to survive here. That being said, there still is a lot of money here. There is almost a full supply dock here. So Rob can again come back. If Chaka is not paying attention, that is. Chaka does have internet center, but doesn't have the second spy satellite upgrade. And look at this. He's going to find Rob here. Rob trying to run away. His last dose are going into the Chinook. Are there any Gatling cannons on the Overlords? Yes, we got one and two and three. They might be able to take out the Chinook. Chinook trying to get away. Getting taken out. And there goes the last dozer for Rob. Rob officially out. He's only got one supply center. And that is it. Rob calling the GG. Very nicely played. Chaka gets the kill. That's an extra point for Chaka. Well played. Yellow Peace, says Logica, kills Cyan. And here we go. There are three players left. And now we get the 1v1v1. The almighty 1v1v1. That always happens. Either two players fight each other in a 1v1. And one guy builds up. Or we get a 2v1. And the question is, what is going to happen here? So, Chaka, very well played there. And Rob taking the fourth place. Let's see, where is Rob? Position four, which gets him three points, which puts Rob at a mere seven points. Poor guy. He tried to get to the late game, especially here, but uh, Chaka didn't allow it. He said, fuck off, Rob. I don't want you in the late game. Nobody wants you in the late game, man. You'll be too strong. And he said, no. And look at this, guys. This is what I'm talking about. Nuke is such a great army in free-for-all. So much damage. If Chaka was not dozer hunted, he could have been so much more powerful. And to be honest, I don't even think Logica realizes he's dozer hunted. And I don't think Malik realizes either. Because when your internet uh, center satellite kicks in and you scroll here, you see a huge base. A huge base. And that just kind of makes you think that the person isn't dozer hunted because why would they they have a huge base but this is the thing so it could be a secret weapon here for chakra that no one realizes and chakra chooses to go for malik i don't know if this is a good idea at this point i would say it's probably better for him to work together with malik and take out logica the reason is the emp fucking patriots right now chakra cannot call in rt barrage chakra cannot call in a carpet bomber it's just not gonna happen it's not gonna work in fact he needs to rely on malik to do so and if he can clear this, then yes, Logica will be out. And then later he can always use new cannons to try and take out Malik. That is what I would suggest. That being said though, I think Chaka at this point just feels that Malik is stronger, but Malik doesn't wait around. He says, fuck this, GG and surrenders. By doing an early surrender, it does actually sort of help Chaka a bit. 
Except for, if you waited a little longer, this particle cannon might have gone on Malik, which now is a bit of an issue, because Chaka is dozer hunted. So that is Malik in third place, giving him four points, putting Malik at a total of ten points for this free-for-all challenge. And now it is Chaka versus Logica. We've got Particle Cannon coming in and takes out the prop. A very, very heavy blow. Takes out the power. He still has power though, but no more Overlords. And will these hackers survive? Yes, they do. And this is gonna be very difficult for Chaka to win. Because right now there's no more access to Overlords, no more access to ECMs. Here we go, EMP Patriots. This is what I'm talking about. It becomes such a fucking traffic jam and the mess. And Chaka cannot really push through here. And Logica will just sit here with his Humvees and just slowly blow them up. And these are the last Overlords. Oh no, says Chaka. He realized he's in trouble. Meanwhile, we also have Humvees here in the base, taking out the last oils. I also see that Chaka took these. Very nice. But uh, it's pretty much over from here on out. Logica is going to take this game. Boys, oh boys. Look at that. Plus, Logic is level 5, so he's going to have Moab, Spectre, A10, all those great things to take out buildings. And Chaka just can't lose buildings at this point. Because of fucking Rob. Seriously, it's amazing. If the if the command center was still alive for Chaka, it would have made a big difference. It really would have. He would have been able to use RT Barrage, Carpet Bomb to maybe try and get rid of the Humvees, Mines, and all those things. But uh, no, none of that now. And uh, it looks like Logica might just win this match. That being said, Logica does not get the kill on Malik because it was a 2v1. So Logica doesn't get a point there. And here we go. This Humvee army might be caught out here. Overlord is not yet yeah, turning the turret. And it's just going to be... Look at all the Patriots. Look at the minimap. There is a, a nice clean line of EMP Patriots. And that is very well played by Logica. That is what he needs to do because Chaka just simply cannot engage. He needed new cannons or Inferno cannons, but seeing how the prop center has been killed, that's not going to do anything. And, uh... What? Did I... What? Logica doesn't have advanced training. What? Okay, so this upgrade here, advanced training, is very fucking good. So what it does is your units get veterancy twice as fast. That's these little these little chevrons. Like, these guy, this guy has, like, three vet. That's what we like to say, or vet three. All right? And that makes a big difference. You want them to have all the veterancy. And Logica doesn't have this upgrade. It's 1,500. It's a very good upgrade. I'm really surprised. To be honest, I think Pro Rules is broken. Should be no super weapons allowed. It's OP. Well, everyone has the right to their opinion. But these are the rules we're playing with, and we agree to. And look at this, he has a really nice army. Going Red Guard is a good call, but actually, Logica is ready for it. He's got snipers, and Chaka's trying to find an opening, but Logica closed all the openings. Logica now with a big Humvee army here in Chaka's base, and that will probably be the GG. Every building lost will seriously hurt Chaka. Right now we have just one War Factory left, and, I mean, a barracks, but what's that going to do? And all these Humvees have a nice veterancy. The sniper's going fucking crazy here, killing all these hackers. Easy kills. The only thing Logica has to do is survive this. And here we go. Here comes the leaflet or the fuel air. It's the fuel air. And, ooh, actually very good uh, dodging here from Chaka. He, d he still loses units, though. There is no way around that. He's losing units. And that's probably going to be the GG. This army is now too small to really, you know, seriously pierce through the defenses of Logica. Meanwhile, Logica back in Chaka's base, also clearing up everything. And all Logica needs to do is kill this barracks, kill this war factory, and it's GG. Well, okay, there's another barracks here, but what's, what, what are barracks going to do? And, uh, yeah... GG, well played, says Chaka, and Logica gets another point, this time for killing Chaka. Well, actually, maybe not. Maybe we have to see if uh, if Rob is involved in that. So that puts the position of Logica as first, which means he gets an extra seven points. And Chaka coming in second place. 
giving him five points. Which means that right now, unverified guys, these are the unverified points. Chaka has earned himself six points, plus the seven he had, Chaka at 13. Dominator was at 14. Logica, this still needs to be checked out, guys, still needs to be checked out. Logica gets one point for killing Dominator, but I'm not assigning the point for him for killing uh, Chaka just yet. That has to be investigated. Um, so that puts him at 8 points for this match, he already had 8, which puts him at 16 points. Now, let's see, we have Rob at 7 points, Shay at 18 points, and Malik at 10 points. Which means that, according to the points I have, the winner is, hands down, Shay with 18 points. This um, challenge, followed by Logica with 16, followed by Dominator with 14. So I'm gonna update the scores. But I will not, and I repeat, I will not say that these are the final scores just yet. So let me just update the score here. All right, let's 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 see. Uh, scores are unverified. Uh, they will be verified via the replays. But uh, the scores are... Chaka, 13 points, Dominator, 14 points, Logica, 16 points, Rob, 7 points, Shea, 18 points, Malik, 10 points. Unverified, okay? I'm making that crystal clear! <laughs> so, by the looks of it, Shay wins 100, yay! Logica wins 35, yay! And uh, Domi wins 15, yay! <laughs> oh man, uh, yeah, but that's the thing, man. In the second game, Shay got a fucking staggering 11 points, and in the first game, he came second place. Don't worry guys, all points will be verified. Um, make sure to contact me on Discord and tell me what you think. If you deserve a point or not, or if someone des uh, else deserves a point or not. Show me uh, timestamps with the replay please. Not like, oh, but I think this and I think that. Someone says, why did Shay only get two points? Because he didn't kill anyone. And Shay actually was the first person to get eliminated in the match. And how the score is set up is if you end up being fifth place or sixth place, uh, you, you get two points. The reason we've done it like that is because, hey, you know, sometimes you get rushed. And, you know, sometimes a guy literally gets rushed at the same time as you. One guy quits half a second before the other guy because of rushes and shit and it's like look otherwise a person has no chance of doing a proper comeback so yeah i see mass pro Kayla saying reread the entire chat afterwards you'll see what i'm talking about dude don't worry you guys know me i always read the chat and uh you know what you know what should i play should i play <laughs> now that it's done <laughs> Uh, oh wait, I actually didn't update the totals here. I just wrote it in the chat of uh, the, the thingy. So let me just put it here for you all to see. So you guys can share lovely screenshots and spoil it for all the people who haven't watched this live stream. Ugh, don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Oh man, I have to say, I feel bad for Rob though. I have to, like, he's a really good player. He really, really is. And like, nobody wanted him to get big. So they're like, I don't care. I'm gonna make sure Rob dies. Uh, wait, what's happening? What's happening? No! Dude, what are you doing? Wait, you started the game. What are you... Logica, what are you doing, man? Okay, yeah. Okay, give me give me a sec, guys. Give me a sec, give me a sec. So I'm just updating the score here for you all to see. And, uh... Yeah, it would have been nice to have Sniper on board, so... Pity, pity no Sniper. Um, is he actually online now? No, he's not. Okay. Good luck, guys. Rob leaves. Aw. Feels bad, man. Really does. Really does. Okay, so I had a load of people messaging me. So uh, let me let me host. Let me host. You join. Then uh, what is it? I give you host again. All right. So there you go, guys. Those are the scores. Um, 
It was great games, right? It was great games. Uh, yeah, I'm just closing all the messages here, so let's do... Shall we do a DEFCON FFA? Just for the lols. Pro rules, pro players. You know, you know what's gonna happen, right? Shay's gonna join, Dominator's gonna join, Logica's gonna join, and I'm gonna fucking win! You know. <laughs> Uh, let me let me let me see if they want to come. How did Shay get points in the last game? He came last. Six, uh, fifth place and sixth place give two points. Yeah. All right, let's see. So Shay is maybe going offline. I see Tengri coming online. Hey, that's great. I said it. Shay win from the beginning, says TR. Yeah, man. Oh, great stuff. Anyway, so let me switch up my screen so you guys see the usual again. Whoosh, just like that. Okay, so I'm going to start Discord, and I'm going to go on Discord. For those of you who want to have a chat with me on Discord and all that shit going on. Yay. Yeah, I will play now, guys. I will play. I will play. Malik has to go. No. Oh, don't go, Malik. Malik left. I killed purple and yellow. Actually, two. Purple and yellow. Yeah, well, um, we have to see if you killed yellow. Because Rob Dozer hunted him. See, that's the... Th <laughs> he didn't even know. <laughs> He didn't even know. But we'll have to see, we'll have to see. Of course I killed Yellow, he was the last guy. Yes, but Rob already did considerable damage to him by dozer hunting him. So, I mean, if you if you take a nuke general who's dozer hunted, then all you need to do is kill a prop and basically you can't really build anything. So, we'll, we'll have to look it out, we'll, we'll, we'll check it out, we'll check it out. And we see a Lakeys. Is this the real Lakeys? Will the real Lakeys please stand up? I think it is the real Lakeys. So, add to friends. Ooh. Ooh, very nice. Okay, um, let's ask everyone if they're pro. One, two, three, four, four pro. Yeah, so this is the thing, guys. Um, for those of you who aren't too happy with, uh, with what's going on, with the uh, scoring, don't worry, it's all gonna get checked out. And one thing's for sure, Please, please make sure that if you are unhappy with the scores, don't just say it. Oh, I'm unhappy. Come with some proof. Send it to me on Discord. I will check it out. I always do. All right. Right now, I have only two people who sent me messages. Not very good. So if you guys are unhappy with the scores, I want to see reasons. I want to see proofs and all these great things. Okay, so four says he is pro. Five. Are you pro? Five pro? Nah, let's not do an A player. No, no, no. I want to do def and kill Logica. I won't even use keyboard. No hockeys. I just, you know, stare at him long enough and he will die. Cause I'm feeling it, baby. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Legion, how are you doing today, man? Hey, King, how are you doing? You've been enjoying the games. Yes, I have, man. Those are some crazy matches, man. Crazy. I know, I know, I know. <coughs> Oh yeah, I hope, uh, by the way, this week's casting was uh, was a little bit low energy because I was actually sick yesterday, but I'm doing much better today. That's good, that's good. Yeah. And like those matches, man, just, wow, they were crazy. <laughs> I, I still remember that one EMP where he got the whole entire army, but didn't follow up with the carpet. Oh. oh man, it's true, man. It's so good. Uh, no, but seriously, like we we had some real great games here, and I also want to say a big shout out to the sponsor, aka Baloney, for making this happen. This was really cool. This was oh shit, shit, whoops, I forgot. Wow, no, 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 no. okay, uh, <laughs> shit, okay, I made a mistake. <laughs> 
Okay. Yeah, no, but um, thanks very much to AK Baloney for making this happen. Putting up $150 so that the first prize would be $100 is just amazing, you know? Like, to make this happen and have everyone fight to reach that first place. And I have to say, like, Shay in that second game, oh, man. Oh, he was unstoppable. And this is the thing. People don't realize, you know, the dangers of Shay until it is too late. He's just very good and, uh, yeah. Yeah, like all these all these players that you had in here, like Dominator, Logica, and Shay. Like, I've watched uh, well, I've watched Dominator for a while, and I've been starting to watch a little bit of Logica, a little bit of Shay when they play. Like, honestly, like top notch players, and I I honestly hope that I can become as good as one of them one day. Because like, oh my god. Oh yeah, actually, my, my, my management of the game isn't that great. If you if you look at Shay, I think he's only been uh, around for maybe four years or something, like not even that long, and he's just really good. And as you can see, like he's he's probably gonna take that hundred dollars home, guys. Like I mean, he's got eighteen points, not yeah. seventeen. It's not that tight, you know what I mean? Uh, let me just say pro rules. So, you know, that's that's really cool that, you know, he's he's just so good and he's motivated and he plays a lot. And this is the thing, like even everybody's watching right now, if you are new to this stuff and it's like, well, I used to play this game a long time ago. If you say, hey, you know what, I'm going to get good at this, install the game and play and just spam games. Then, yeah, it's very much possible. And we see new players being really good. You know, they keep popping up here and there. And Shay is just, I think, another one of those. You know, he's really good. Yeah. And honestly, um, made in the US I've actually, like, okay, so me and my father, my stepfather, we used to play this back in the day when the servers were back online, back oh, in like, yeah. the early 2010s, early 2009s. I was around when the original servers were around. Yeah, I was around. Too, man. I used too. to play as Air Force all the time. <laughs> oh, man, oh, Air Force. Ready. Surprisingly, I kicked a lot of ass with it. <laughs> Yeah, no, Air Force is great, but the, the thing is, in free-for-all, Air Force actually isn't that good because it's so strong. And that makes people feel nervous, and then you often get a 2v1. So, like, what, what pretty much sucks is if you're in the middle position, so, like, this position here, and your Air Force, because you might just get rushed by both players at the same time, because no one wants to deal with an Air Force later in the game. All right, so here we are. I am Super Weapon General, and I have Red above me, who I don't really know. Mr. Med, I don't know him. And I have TR over here to my side, who's also Super Weapon. So I'm getting a fast Patriot, and I'm getting fast oil. So the thing is, what I'm trying to go for is fast Patriot might just help in case he does a drop. Okay, I don't think he's going to do a drop. No, so guys, the, the goal of the day, like what I have to do here, I have to kill Logica, right? That, that's it. That's what it's about. So um, let, me, let, me just, let me just troll him. Let me troll him. <laughs> oh, boy. I can't wait to see that. <laughs> oh, I love doing this. So, yeah, there is actually a stream delay on of about two minutes, something like that. So a decent, oh, decent stream delay. Um... Yeah, you didn't want any stream snipers, Yeah, I didn't want any stream sniping and whatever. Mind you, it could have still happened, but, you know, the players, they're all, they're all you know, high-tier players. We all just want to have good games, and yes, there's money involved, but, you know, we would rather, like, be respectful, have good games, than try and, like, oh my god, money, you know? Like, people actually are, like, these are good players. They don't want to just ruin their reputation for, like, cheating and shit. And uh, so I, I didn't have to worry too much, but there was still a stream delay and uh, I didn't see any weird shenanigans. Like I said, though, if you guys spot something, especially in the replays, contact me, send me emails and all that shit and uh, I'll check it out. I very much will. And uh, we're doing this fair, boys. We're doing this nice and fair. So I'm going to go for Mr. Red. I hope he's not going to hate me. He's probably going to hate me. Ah, oh, shit. Got a gap. Oh, well, we'll just have to go plan B. <laughs> So this is plan B. If you see someone who has a gat, and you're like, oh shit, I can't get in, then you do you do this little trick. You know, very easy, very nice, and like, it's kind of obvious, but like, it's a nice trick. Okay, I'm put the strat here. So the reason I'm putting the strat here is I can put um, search and destroy, and that way I can see any incoming Burtons. Oh shiz. 
Okay, let's just drop this guy here and do some denying of the income. I could try and go for Dozer Hunt, but I don't know. I'm not really feeling it. I don't really want to do that. Provisions on route. Logica, fuck. Oh wait, you're next to Logica? Or does he think I'm Logica? I'm not I'm not Logica. I'm I'm the far from Logica. But you know, I'll I'll take the compliment. Thank you. Thank you very much. Ready for action. Army's elite. Got my Yes, here we go. Kill the dragon tank. Naughty dragon tank. Okay, so we So essentially I need to Oh no! Okay, I lost that shield again. So I want to kill the power. Power is great to kill because it slows down their production. Okay, so he's building a lot of tank hunters. This is not what you want to be doing. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. He's going to walk to the power plant. Power plant's going to blow up and so will these infantry. Look, I'm not even going to do anything. I'm just going to wait. Boom. Two down. Another one low health. I'm just going to get the repair drone. Come along the side here and... I can send another Humvee to kill that Gatling cannon. And I don't know if there are mines. Oh shit! Oh shit! Okay, maybe maybe I shouldn't engage that Gatling cannon. But I do have a, a microwave tank now I can use. So let's do that. Okay, he's building a vanilla battle master. Uh, a vanilla battle master to kill my Humvee. That is not exactly pro tactics, dude. Yeah. Um, okay, I'm, I'm a little uh, speechless here in a bad way. <laughs> That's not good, man. Yeah. Okay, at least I'm getting some kills. Um, search and destroy, let's do it. And uh, did I upgrade? Oh, I thought I upgraded this. My bad. Yeah, and I'm gonna get the kill on this now. I'm gonna laser lock that. Look at that, easy kills. Microwave is going out there, that's nice. And I can fill this guy up as well, so let's go here. And oh shit! No! I forgot to... No! Okay, Ooh, I got lucky there, I thought I was going to lose most of my, my missile defender dudes. Wait, get in the Humvee, you shits! Just do it! Good boys. Okay, let's upgrade advanced training. Come on! Give me the money. There we go. <laughs> Shit. Oh no, 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 don't kill my Humvee, please. One fucking tank hunter, don't do it. Okay, whatever. Here we go, microwave tank for the win. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna be real nasty. Does this guy have a CC? No, he doesn't. Okay. Yeah, I don't think this guy is very pro. I, uh, I don't like to be like that guy going like, oh, you're not pro, man. But, it, I mean, you know. Yeah, just kill him. I don't even need to laser lock because it kills quite fast. I mean, my original Humvee's still alive here. And oh no! Yeah, I, I think this is pretty much GG for Red. And you know what? I'll build my strat center here. So, I mean, my my CC. Uh, get tow missiles, and this is Red dead. I kind of want to get... Actually, let's get another Ambo. Oh, Always lol. Prepared. Who's this? It's Lakey's. Oh, right. Lakey's is here. I forgot about that. He's good, too. Gotta be careful. And... Get a Burton. Why not? Congratulations, Wait. Get a Burton. Wait. Search and destroy. Okay. That's that's out of purple. Uh, gotta be careful of purple as well. Let's load that up a little more. Whoa, that is scary shit. Purple, you scary, man. Okay. And I think red is pretty much dead. I think he's forced to go to the middle here. And at some point I sh ah! Shit, mines. Okay, let's just casually wait. Casually wait for that to go. And, uh... Yeah, now I'm gonna have my CC. I can have radar. Is that Logica? Blue. No, that's Lakey's. Logica is... The new drone no, Logica is yellow. Yellow, yellow, yellow. Oh, shit. Should I dozer hunt this guy? Oh, <laughs> oh, should I do it? Oh, man, I want to do it. I want to do it. I want to piss him off. Oh, I want to piss him off. I want to piss him off so bad. Oh, my God. I want to piss him off. Have you made SMD? I mean, search and destroy, because uh, you made it, but you Medical didn't activate it. Here. No, I have it. I have it. I have it. It's activated. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh man, this is this is great shit. Um, 
I can't actually kill both the dozers. Ah, uh, but what I can do is this, and it'll probably kill the dozer. Because dozers are stupid in that. No, actually, I'll, I'll do it like this. So I'll kill that dozer. Cleared for engagement. And I will kill this. And then with the spy drone, I can kill the other um, Gatling cannon turret. Yeah, that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. Because, you know, I have to be a real asshole to, to Logica. You know, I have to be. You know, rub it in. Like, oh, Logica, you're so easy. You know? <laughs> okay, for those of you who don't know Logica, he's really fucking good. And I'm just trolling here. I'm, I mean, he's much better than I am. Okay, where's the dozer car carcass? Oh, shit. He knows what's up. Oh, shit. He knows what's up. Uh... Yeah, he's probably not gonna allow me to have an easy time. Yeah, he knows what's up. Ooh, the MiG's almost fired. Okay, so he's probably gonna... Oh shit, did I actually do a spy drone somewhere? Fuck. No! Shit, I fucked up! Okay. No, there goes my... Uh, uh, it hurts, man. The pain. The pain, man. The pain. Okay, let's let's stop dicking around. Let's actually try and win this, right? Gotta win this, right, guys? Like, I don't even have tow missiles. I feel a bit embarrassed. Okay, so fine, you get your CC, but at least I gave you a big scare, right? Yeah, okay, stop building ambos. Good, stop building ambos. Send one dozer up here. And we just, we just keep harassing, you know? Unit lost. Uh -huh. Oh, wait, no! It didn't capture. Oh, that's so lame. <sighs> what did I do? He's gonna come kill me now. Shit. I done did fuck up. Um, okay, okay, guys. Gotta, gotta think here. Um, let's actually spread these guys out. Motherfucker! He's getting the fucking money. Okay. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. I'll deal with that shit later. Oh, shit. He's got a load of mix. I need, I need Avengers! Motherfucker. Get there, quick. We're there. Okay, kill kill the gat. Kill the gat. I don't give a shit anymore. Just kill the gat. Kill the gat. Wait. Oh. 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 -ho! Well, let's do that. Fuck you, sir. Fuck you. Okay, get up. Get back. Get back. Get back. Yes. Fuck. Why, man? Why? Why you do this? Bring on the scaffolding right here. Whatever. Time demo charge. Oh, is he actually gonna land the MIGs? Oh, he doesn't see the three, two, one. Wait, is it saying twelve? Yes, it is. No. Oh man, these MIGs are gonna take off. I have to manually on, gun him on. down. Gun him down. Gun him down. I say. Good man. Now get out of there. No. Okay. GG. What? Ah, oh, come on. Don't tell me someone else attacked you. It's just out of Burton. Hmm, why quit? Hmm, sad. I'm sad now. Maybe I was a bit too mean there. I probably was. I apologize. I only meant, like, with the best of intentions, you know? You know, a killing a player with the best of intentions. Okay, I need the upgrade. It's coming. And I need a... You know what? Let's get this dozer here. Right, so who do I have to worry about? He could with do a the... I believe Ah, uh, what? I said he could beat him Leech no in Yeah, he, he, just, he just quit now. I mean, I'm, I'm all sad. <laughs> I was hoping to, like, you know... Oh, shit! Oh, I knew it! I knew it! Whose is it? It's Lakey's. Kill it! Kill it with fire! Fuck you, Lakey's. No, he's got mix. Shit, I don't like this. Okay. Serving our country. Uh, new plan. Do I have any units? No. I actually do not. So, let's actually get some shit here. Uh, so I guess I guess it's me versus Lakey's then, eh? Oh, Lakey's actually has mid. Wait, blue is Lakey's, right? Can you evac? Gino evac. I don't understand. Okay, so I guess probably at this point a barracks would be good, and my microwave tank will stop your Lotus. Oh, yes. Yeah, actually, look at this. He has a choice to make. Kill the microwave. Yeah, he went all for the microwave. 
Didn't I have two rangers here? Yeah, yeah I do. Go. Okay. Ready for action. And do I have snipers? No. Fucking our base. All he's got is MIGs. Seriously, this guy's just got MIGs. Um. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. We gotta make some decisions, boys. We gotta make some decisions. Um. Yeah, I can't make any decisions. Okay. I'd still need another dozer there, though. Okay, my income is pretty good. So I'll just start by putting... Oh, wait. Oh, he stole my <laughs> he stole my barracks. <laughs> I didn't think he would do that. All right, let's look at what's going on here. Let's try and piss off Mr. Lakey's. He doesn't seem to have any income, and he is normal China, so I should be able to take it. Oh, actually, he's got the middle here. That is... A bit worrying, just a bit. We can take care of you. All right. Uh, should be all right here. And oh, those MIGs, though. Doesn't it hurt? Yes, it does. Ooh, now comes choice. Do I get snipers? Nah, I'm gonna get these. What's this? An airfield? You're building an airfield there? Dude, that's like so fucking optimistic. It's amazing. Oh, lol. Okay, he, he actually disabled my uh, little dude here. Uh, I'm gonna need another Chinook if you don't mind. And I need to reinforce my army. Badly. Very badly. And oh shit, he actually is killing the Avengers. Man, fuck you. Man, how do you do this? What? What the fuck did he do that for? Did he try desperately to intercept? Oh. Okay. I'm confused. But whatever. My income stopped is still much better, so who gives a shit, man? I don't give a shit. I need Avengers, though. I need Avengers. He's just getting airfields! Why are you just getting there? Oh, I forgot about those babies. Uh, did I have a range of here? Always prepare. Rally point confirmed. Okay, so he's doing RT on me, obviously. And this guy over here. He's probably gonna go for my strat center with that RT. And I'm probably gonna go low power soon, so I need to get some power up. Yeah, no, he's going for strat center, yeah. Oh, can we, can we take that thing out? I would appreciate that. Is he going for my power? Or drop zone, maybe? Yeah, he was trying to go for my power. Didn't quite work out, did it? <laughs> okay, so I have two Avengers here. Should be alright. And someone's disconnecting. Mr. Med, let's vote him. Still sad you... L okay. I want to say still sad you left, yeah. but... I wasn't fast enough. Okay, so here we go. We got a nice little army. I suspect there's a Lotus here now. Yeah, there we go. I have map hack, guys. I have map hack. And then I will park these fuckers over here. And there we go. And we'll get What's a new strat. Story? Why not, right? I do Always need to build another uh, EMP job. here just to keep my shit safe. Evac, motherfuckers! Okay, they're evac. Good boys. Okay, we have a bit of lag. Who be if of lagging? Alright, we got two Avengers here. Come on. And now it's going to be a little difficult for Mr. Lakey's to engage. Just a little bit difficult. Not very difficult, just a little bit. And he has to... Actually, I'm a bit in trouble here. Yeah, let's get the fuck out of here. Let us get the fuck out of here. Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, boys. Come on. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, here come the MiGs. Oh, he's not striking properly. Oh, my God. All the MiGs missed. All the MiGs missed. Oh, my God. Gosh, it's beautiful. Oh, look at that. Formation perfect. He's trying to take out the Avengers. Oh, oh wait, no. And my, my V. He, he killed one V. Right, I still don't have S&D. Maybe, maybe I engaged a little premature there. Fuck it. Get out of there. Get out of there. We did some damage. I'm happy. And... Yeah, I kind of have to worry. I mean, I'm kind of worrying that I'm giving him too much money. Uh... Keep that is probably the truth. Got my missile launcher right here. That is the truth. So Cyan, I mean, purple actually is pretty big here as well. Oh, did he just engage this? Oh, that is interesting. 
Oh, you motherfucker. You're trying to engage my little babies, aren't you? But I have two EMPs here. Oh, how are you not firing? Fire, you shit! There we go. Oh, losing MIGs here. Love it. Okay, um... I think I'll take this out, like that. Alright, and I need a Burton as well. Let's pop some tanks. So, sure thing. let's go in here. here. Targeting cursor and, Advancing. ooh, my, my Chinooks are all kind of damaged. Oh, for this. Right I can just take a clean, oh, happy Chinook. This. this guy is happy. Game was over. I lost my MIG and couldn't stop USA and Blue was expanding. Yeah. Ah oh, man, pity though. I wanted to like have a struggle to the death. You know, I was just trying to be like annoying and harassing. Maybe I went a little too far. Okay, I don't have an ambo now. I need another Chinook. Whatever, I'll, I'll drop off the ambo later. Uh, let's see what's over here. Okay, so I tell you what, I'm gonna send rangers up there. And I essentially need more money. And I am Super Weapon General, so I think it's about time. Is it time? It might freak out Purple, but I gotta do something. And let's put Search and Destroy, right? Okay. Evac, evac, evac! Get the fuck out of there, boys! Alrighty then, off we go. So, you guys are my super team, and oh, Blakey's just quits. Huh. Everyone just casually quitting. That, that makes things uh, very interesting and quite easy, I guess. Why is everyone just quitting? What happened to the good old days where you were like, bitch, I'm a fight until I have one scaffold. One fucking scaffold. Okay, so maybe this guy's just very scary. Now I'm really glad I got the super weapon uh, built up, right? Oh, boys. What do you got? Where are we going? Okay, so I'm taking out the strat. And, uh, yeah, I guess I'll just build more shit, right? Uh, let's see. This this is nice. I get to see what the guy has. He's got snipers, which is funny because I actually don't. Um, okay, let's uh, let's just have a look what's happening over here. I sent some uh, these guys. Let me just send one up here as well. Look at all the oil. We are living in an oily world. Okay. Let's get a couple of these. And uh, yeah, I'm actually not doing too bad here. I need to get a few fire bases up just to deter him from coming to attack me. And there still is money here. You know what? I'm just gonna get that money. Like I was a bit scared doing it before with Lakeys and shit, but now I'm starting to feel a little more confident, thinking it's not a bad idea. And you boys can go right away and collect that. So, so far we have nothing in the middle here. I don't have an ambo with this little army. Maybe I can reinforce that army as well. So, I don't think the guy realizes... Wow, I built a lot of ambos here. I don't think the guy realizes that I don't have snipers. Je ne sais pas that he knows. Okay. I could just build a few random EMP patriots just to make his life a little more difficult. Shit, amount of money now. Um, oh, look at this. Right, so the thing is, I have a few Avengers in here which will help me. And, wow, that's a lot of money in the middle there. Check it out. Is that even untouched? Yeah, it's untouched. No way. Okay. Uh, I don't have leaflet. I would love a leaflet right about now. My Avengers are in a decent position. He's still building a strat. I think I want to take out some of his income. Okay, so now he's going to let me kill this bunker. He shouldn't let me kill this bunker. He can't engage me. That's the Oh, he's coming a bit close. Oh, yeah, yeah, gotta be careful there, buddy. Can't come too close. So the trick is this. I right now have to keep building by, uh, the scout drones. Okay, so that is... Oh, he's coming too close. He's coming too close. That being said, I did lose a, a Humvee here as well. And down she goes. Okay, so I'm going to get some Tomahawks as well. Because why not? I have a decent amount of money here. And... Oh, right, this guy and this guy. Right, we've got a Burton still in here. 
Uh, maybe we can go around the back and just do some harassment. Uh, there's that oil there that I wouldn't mind destroying. Maybe I can even come around the back here and destroy his oil from this side. That would actually help out a lot. Now he's all cool and like, oh, I don't mind engaging. That being said, he's got to be careful. Look at Avengers in here. If I could just slowly eat up his army. Look at that, like that. Then it'll really help me out. Look at that. Oh, that guy survived. Could take him out, but what's he doing, man? What's he doing? Oh, shit. He's just engaging. What are you doing? Haha, <laughs> I fucked up. I'm not noob, man. Dude, says Mr. Med. All right. It happens. It happens. Thanks for the donation, man. I have low money. GG. GG. Yeah, I have quite a bit here. Yeah! Woo! Okay, I'm, I'm gonna count that as like me killing Logica. What, what do you guys think in the chat? You guys think I, I, I won against... <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I just had a good army and Logica, I took out his MiGs. Um, that is basically how, you know, Logica got a bit screwed there. But uh, yeah, Lakey's quit quite soon as well. I was a bit surprised. Got low money, can't beat. Yeah, that's true, GG. Oh, that was nice. Shall we do one more? Yeah, let's do one more. Haha. <laughs> let's see, everyone agrees? Yeah, go, go. All right, let's see. Mr. Med's probably gonna come and kick my ass now. <laughs> He's like, bitch, you speak about me, I'm gonna kill you. I'm like, fuck. <laughs> uh, yeah, but being fucking China against USA is tough, guys. It's fucking tough. So I get the frustration for Logica and even Lakey's. Like, oh man. Lack of snipers is criminal. Yeah, I didn't actually have snipers in that game. I, I don't know why. I was like, nah, I'd rather have like an A10 or a Spectre or shit. I, I wanted Leaflet as well, but you know, you only get so many points. Uh, I actually got a coffee for today's live stream. And I still didn't finish it. Like, it's, it's, it's colder than room temperature somehow. It's like someone threw an ice cube in it. That's how cold my coffee is. But I don't mind. I like coffee. All right. Let's do it. Let's play one more match. All right. So how's everyone in the chat? Everyone having a good time? Pro rules diminishes my will to play free-for-all as a China, says Lakeys. Yeah, I, I can imagine. Uh, you know, as all on Legionnaire. <laughs> Heart. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine the frustration there that uh, Lakeys is saying because... Um, Wait, didn't he say, he said one min, he said one min. Okay, because as a super weapon general, I can get particle cannon. And I mean, normal China really has a hard time there. I mean, they really rely on their MiGs. You take out the MiGs, it's like GG, man. It's it's pretty much over. Okay, here we go. We are the almighty demo general. <laughs> oh shit, I have an infantry next to me. What do you want with me? No one attack me. Yeah. <laughs> No one attack me. A great premise of starting a free-for-all tournament. I mean, free-for-all match. Like, fuck, man. I want re. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm gonna get rushed by infantry here. I just know it. So I can't go too crazy. I need to go very defensive. So the thing is with infantry, they're actually not that good at dealing with tunnel networks. As funny as it is, they really are not. So if I am just fast and getting tunnels up, um, then I don't really have to worry so much. So I am going to spend a little more than I would like to normally on tunnels. Like two tunnels per side pretty much guarantees that infantry can't do anything. That being said, he might come with a dragon tank on this side, so I need to be fast. And in the end, I don't know which side uh, infantry is on. Probably he's in the middle island. The reason I'm saying that is because... Um, that is the more likely... Yeah, here, look at this, look at this. Shit, my tunnel's gonna complete. This guy might be fucked, though. Look at this! Blue! Fuck off, buddy! Oh, can we kill that minigunner, please? Oh, shit, Blue's gonna lose that dozer. That's actually a big blow there. And he's going dual supply truck. Fuck, this guy's going aggressive. I should probably uh, block my little dudes here. I'll put a demo trap just to be on the safe side. Is he retreating? Look at that, he's going all in! 
That's what I'm talking about, man. These guys get fucking ruthless. Capture building. Upgraded. Nice. Oh, man. Look at this. He's coming with another supply truck. Changing his mind. Thank you. Yes, please change your mind. Now I need to keep this area secure on the right. I mean, uh, like, down here in the middle section. Okay, so at least now my workers are safe. Ish. Safer. Sort of. And I'm gonna get another tunnel. So he basically can't engage me from the side. That's what that means. That's what that will do. Uh, no one seems to be going for the middle, but there is that infantry guy. He might choose to engage there as well. Oh, that was Lakey's. And he just quits. Well, uh, that happened. Why, why, why is he playing free-for-all if he quits so quickly? Who, who attacked him? Like what, one unit came to his base? It's like two minutes in, what happened? Oh, that happened. <laughs> is that Logica? Yes, it's Logica. Okay, um, right. Uh, let's think, boys. Let's think. Stinger, stinger, stinger. Gotta keep myself alive here. He's probably gonna kill that. Uh, he's probably gonna kill my barracks. So the only thing you can really do here is try and survive. That's logic, right? Yeah. What you can try do is... Oh, well. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of fucked. <laughs> oh, je suis fucked. Ladies and gentlemen. Je suis très fucked. The only thing I can do is hope that he comes close and then my RPGs take out his little shit. Um, that's all I can try and do. Probably that is a bit optimistic. Okay, so I built this here. And now I need... Yeah, here we go, here we go, here we go. And now he, he can't really engage this. This is a bit dangerous. Are my guys gonna fire? Is he gonna fire? Or is he gonna evac? He can always evac. He can always evac. Let's see. Oh, he's gonna engage! Dude, what are you doing? It's so risky. Okay, so we have... Who's this? TR. Yeah, TR. I, I have nothing, buddy. <laughs> Je suis mort. I have nothing. Absolutely nothing. Just the middle. But nothing. Really, truly. Trust me. Trust me. I, I tell this... I speak the truth sometimes. Very rarely, but sometimes. Um, the biggest question is, what's TR going to do? Is he actually going to come in and take me here? He might. I like these long distance collecting workers. Like, what are you even trying to do? Oh, look at this. A dragon tank. Shit. Get back in. Get back in. Get back in. Cancel. Cancel. Fuck this. Fuck this. Is this Logica? Yes, it's Logica. Logica, you. Why you do this? You have too much fun. He, he wants vengeance for the last game. I don't blame him. You know, I don't blame He's China again. Oh, man. Okay, you guys can all just like kill yourselves, like honestly, like go, go kill each other, you know? Go, have fun. Well, I'm trying to like hold on here and shit. Oh, he just got black napalm, great. Leggy, wait, Leggy, that's second base? Uh, I'm, I'm, I have no base. I have no base. I have no place that I call home. I am a drifter. I am homeless. <laughs> okay, I back off. Okay, that works. And I'm sure Logica's like, no, don't do it. Okay, fuck. There goes that. Um, I kind of do want to get a war factory at some point. Hey, Logica, I have a great idea. How about you fuck off? Can you reach? Oh, please tell me you can reach. You can't reach. You can kill the mix. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be out, guys. I'm gonna be casting this one. Oh, shit. Oh, this guy might be in range of... Yeah, so stingers actually do good damage against dragon tanks. Yellow as well. No, yellow. Don't do it, yellow. Don't do it, yellow. Yellow, don't do it. Who's yellow? Mr. Med. No! I made too many enemies in the last game. Now they're all coming for me. <laughs> Uh, guys, I'm really nice, okay? I'm really nice, especially on Fridays. I'm a blast to be with. Okay, wait, he's actually gonna check my main base. And it's like, well, that's rather empty. Yes, yes it is. No need to engage me. I only play a free-for-all if I feel like I have at least 60% chance of winning. Anything less is just wasting time. Getting inf in the top middle between Gile and China, Leg uh, Legionnaire and Logica, 
Uh, it is why it's a why bother game. Well, because you can still win. It's free for all. There's always a chance. Only by doing nothing do you know that you will lose. And Lakey's disconnects. Okay. Let's see, I'm still not quite dead. Um, I'm tempted to get a palace. Let's get a palace. Because I actually have money here, guys. I'm, I mean, I can't believe that like no one's eradicated me from the middle yet. Like I know everyone kind of wants to, but... Oh, well, there we go. Uh, do we quads? Quads, please. Quick, ready yourself. Quads are nice. Yes, quads. But I have so many fucking stingers, anti-air, you name it. I have all ready these guys yourself. as well. Oh, the demo trap blew up. Oh, I like that. Uh, I'm kind of curious what's happening. Bob, go investigate. Go for it, Bob. And if you're a good boy, I might give you shoes one day. Okay. He's never going to get the shoes, but, you know, just keep them optimistic. Who's mining this? No one. Are you kidding me? Uh, what is going on? I'm, I'm confused, guys. I'm, 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 I'm really lost. Why is no one mining this? Oh, just rebuild then, right? I mean, not a biggie for me. There was a guy in here as well. I remember that. Uh -huh. Is this going to be a weird position where I actually get the full middle and... Yeah, I think I might just get full middle and get my base back. Okay, I'm out of oils. But, yeah. <laughs> Legionnaire has middle! <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh man, I'm losing it. <laughs> One big red blob in the middle. No, I don't have middle. What are you talking about, sir? <laughs> Me? Middle? Why? Why would I do such a thing? Come on. My palace even finished. I love it. Oh no, 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 no. Shit. Oh yeah, he's coming, boys. He's coming. Oh, yeah, my tunnel can actually fire at this thing. Um, yeah. Maybe at this point I should just... Oh, hello. Wait. So, Logica is normal China, right? Yeah, normal China. Oh, fuck, a dragon tank survived. Damn it, and I put all my quads... Oh, yo, 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 yo. Okay, let's see. Can I maybe engage this? Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Green, don't do it, Muddy. Don't do it. No, Green, don't. Okay, Green is fighting yellow. Is he? I, I don't I don't even know anymore. I don't even know anymore. Oh, hello. Yes, clear that shit up. Okay, lots of stingers, because all this guy has is MiGs, essentially. And you guys, back to work. Oh, wait, no. Actually, we've got to take that. Uh, I hear a tunnel network. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Don't engage, don't engage. Okay. Oh shit, this guy is seriously attacking me? Who is this? Okay, I can take out uh, these guys. Should be alright. Oh shit, everyone, like, no, this is just all Logica. Logica going crazy here. Okay, killed some shit. Losing some shit. Um, I have some money. Uh. Yeah, I kind of want to engage this, but I'd be scared I'll lose the quad. Yeah, can we kill this dragon tank? It would really cheer me up. I'd be much happier. Can we kill him? Yeah, we killed him. Nice. Love it. Okay. I've reached a higher rank, and now I'm being eradicated from the middle. Shit. That is not good. Okay, so I need a new arms dealer. Let's put it here. I think that's a nice place to put an arms dealer. And I lost my barracks! Again! Oh my god. Again. Actually, no, I don't like that location. Oh, we, we build it here. It's much nicer. And, oh, dragon tank got stuck. And my quads got stuck. And, oh, my palace! My beautiful, beautiful baby. <sighs> Okay, not an easy game, this game. Not an easy game. I will obey. I will do the best I can. I'm just a peasant. 
Barracks soon ready. Okay, let's see. Is this guy gonna go down as well? Yes, he is. Let's get some scrap here. Ah, uh, the tunnel killed the dragon tank, so there's no scrap. Kill this boy. Yeah, let's go home. Yeah, okay, so I'm losing everything here. Okay, get back to safety. Do I have a new arms dealer? Yes, I do. And I still don't even have a radar. Man, I need, I need fucking level 3. I want cash bounty for this shit, man. What the hell? I want cash bounty. The amount of dragon tanks that have died here. Oh, shit. It's got Lixes. Lixes. Yeah. Yes. Um. This hammer is heavy. Oh shit! He killed everything. Wait. Quick. Is he actually? Yeah, he's he's fucking it up. He's fucking up the micro. This is still technically alive. The tunnel could rebuild, and I could rebuild here. Be careful. Oh fuck! Who's this? Normal China. Okay. Look at this. He. Okay. I don't mind. I don't mind. Uh, I need to repair all my shit, man. No, he's building another. No. Oh shit! Can I kill those MIGs? No, I probably can't. Fine, I'll sell. I'll sell. My gosh. I need AP bullets. I need a palace. My palace actually is pretty far ready here. Can you kill one MIG, please? You know, just one. I'm not asking for much, dude. Yes, yes. So close to being level three. It hurts. Okay, so palace is ready again. I know what I'm gonna do. I'm actually gonna make a move to try and attack Mr. Logico. I know, right? Who would have thought? No! Shit, I lost him. Let's see, I am demo. I should maybe get demo scuds. It's a good one to get. Oh no, I built a demo bike. I'm a naughty boy. I sense danger maybe near. Okay. Let's spread these floor. babies out uh, just a bit. I do not have oh, you're low health? Yeah, okay, go home. Prepare. So the idea is this. I very, very much suspect that Logica has a bunch of hackers somewhere. I'm just gonna send my Jarman on the bike and kill him off. That's what I think. That's what I think would be a good move. Alright, I also need to focus on my money. Right now, I only have my base supply. In the middle, all that money is mined out, used up. Let's get out of here! Two players are dead, though. Go, go. Which means that... Let's get out of here. Push Let's go. Some guys here have, have... Oh, shit. Here we go. That might be a bait. Is that EMP? Oh, motherfucker. Yeah, here we go. Oh, shit. Not my palace again. Fuck you, man. Oh, shit. No, not my palace again. <laughs> Fuck it. Let's go find some fucking hackers and piss him off. And get some general points. What do you guys think? So, let's... Can I make that? Can I make that jump? Can I make that jump? Make the jump, buddy! Go for it! Yes! Found the hackers! No! Yes! No! Go, 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 go! No! Yes! No! Yes! Yes! Ow! Yes! Do some killing, man! Do some killing! Oh! 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 Look at the XP bar! Look at that XP bar! Look at it go! Oh, you deserve that, you asshole! And oh, I'm dead. Okay. Maybe I should have stopped looking at Jarman there. I was probably having too much fun. Uh, I've won Scud. Okay. Tears. And my Scud is getting stuck. Why you get stuck? Because of these workers. We'll send them <laughs> oh, this game. Why bother getting a remaster? This is just great entertainment. Getting them stuck. Okay, so I need to get my quads up here. And I could get AP bullets. Which I'm just going to get because I kind of need it. Boom! Down she goes and I get cash bounty. Yay, cash bounty. Yay, cash bounty is good. Okay. There we go. Oh, no, my lost market. Oh, it hurts, it hurts, it hurts. Oh, buddy boy. It hurts. Wait, did that fucking flame just destroy my... Yes, it did. It destroyed my scaffold. Okay, at least I'm getting nice kills here. It's not, it's not gonna be enough. 
Oh, boys. Oh shit, he has another... Fucking... No. Hmm. Guys, I think I might be in trouble. Uh, I don't have that much, so I think I might be in trouble. I don't even have 80 bullets, what is this crap? Okay, good quad. Oh shit, another guy snuck in. Fuck, I didn't see him. Shit, I didn't see that guy. Oh, he's giving me the cell, so that's that's nice. Thank you, thank you for giving me the cell. Much appreciated. Uh, I mean, I'm pretty fucked, but <laughs> apart from that, I appreciate that you let me have the cell. He's a cool guy, he's nice. Right? Stop bugging and start killing! Thank you! Speaking of bugging, look at the dragon tank bug out. Oh. All these units, man. Yay, 80 dawa. I get 80 dawa. I'm just a peasant. Let's do it again. I do not have patience for what? this. Don't push me. What do you want? And I kind of want to get more stingers because I just think that more mix are inbound. So I'm just gonna have a little bit of a uh, coffee drink uh, here, because yeah. Lord. Can someone please kill Legionnaire? I am unkillable. Death approached me once and said, dude, you're awesome. I can't just take you. No way. So I am now unkillable. Big eyes. That's not actually true. That's not how it happened. Oh god, he's coming with the carpet. Maybe my quads can take it out. Come on, baby. Take it out, take it out, take it out. Uh, nah, that's good damage. Survived though, but I lost a bunch of workers there. So since Logica is complaining, that means only one thing. Someone's attacking him. <laughs> oh yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Let's piss him off. Kill your fucking supply trucks and shit, and he'll be like, no. Mm. You wanna know the best part? I kill his supply trucks, I get money. Oh, look how angry he is. We got an angry Logica. And do I get another kill? I get 120. Oh, that's great shit. Wait, how, why 120? I have this. I should get 240. Damn it. Maybe I clicked it too slow. Okay, so now we're back to square one. I have to build some quad cannons and all this shit. No, actually... Um... Oh, hello. Oh, he's trying to kill my, my, my arms dealer, isn't he? No, my supply. Yeah, much better target. But the irony is, if I kill your units, I still make money. And the whole survives. Yay! Much love, man. Much love. So I just have to be patient. Yes. So I shall. And I got a free worker here. Okay, super weapon seems to have been sold. Oh, man. Logica. How's killing me going? <laughs> Taunt the enemy. Always taunt the enemy. Oh, man. Oh, okay, okay. I will Time consuming. Yep, I bet you. Okay, can I actually do that? Let me see. No, I can't. <laughs> Just have to make him feel like scared and shit. Let me actually repair that because I don't want... Oh, no, he got infernos. Um... What the fuck do I... Oh, he's just suiciding the Infernos. Oh my god, he's suiciding them. He must have misclicked. Oh, I get 90. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, here come the Migs. Um, yeah, I think... Wait, none of them die? Come on. None of the Migs die. That's so not, not cool, man. That is so not cool. And this guy's pretty much dead. GG says green. You see, I'm actually hanging on here, boys. I'm hanging on here, you know. You should be proud. Logica is win. Mm. He probably is. Legionnaire does does what? I'll get there. Oh man, this this stinger is just like so screwed. Dude, one gat tank could take it out. Begin stitching. Oh, 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 oh. What does more damage? No. I'm gonna take this out though. Yeah, I got it. Nice. Get out of there, buddy! Yeah, now I heal him. Wait, how many people are left? Okay, just me, Logica, and another dude. 
Okay, I, I don't feel optimistic about this match, guys. I, I think I think we might lose this one. Maybe. 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 You know, let's explore the middle, shall we? It's probably full of units from Sign. Probably. You know, I kind of need more quads. I don't know what I'm doing. I need quads. Pink piece? Are you mad? Okay, get back to safety, buddy. Get back to safety. There we go. Ah. Let's see what's going on in the middle. Maybe I can build some supplies. Mm-hmm. 5k. Interesting. It's not much, but it'll, it'll help. Look at that. I've got three quads now. Haha. -ha. He'll have to use a MIG volley to stop these. ECM, eh? I see what you're trying to do. And... Fuck you! Get out of there! No, I'm gonna lose one. Shit. Okay. I need more quads, though. I really, really do. And I need him to make, like, a mistake and chase my quads down. I don't think he'll do that, though. Logic is not exactly a new... Here, come, 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 come. Chase my quads. Chase my quads. I will work. All right, let's try try and get optimistic. Get another supply stash out here. Can I reach his inferno from this top of the hill here? Please tell me you could shoot. Yeah! Oh man, this must piss him off so much. Oh my god, that must piss him off. Love it. Wait, what happened to the worker I sent down here? Oh, there we go. Yeah, logic is around. Uh, Damn it. Floor floor, huh? Why you do this, man? Make it easy for me. Get on my what? Side. Let's see what he says to that. No! You know, this might have still been worth it, though. I collected a thousand. I didn't build too many workers. Okay, I can engage that gat. And these guys are still mining, so hey, it, it kind of works. And I definitely need a palace. Look at that, I kill another gat. I'm so fucking annoying, I love it. No, okay, but this is my main supply is out of money now. Okay. So I'm, I'm gonna have to survive off of cash bounty here. So I think, how much is left here? 1,000. Maybe I should just get a Jarman. I don't even have a barracks, but I can get a Oh shit, he's got an overlord here. No! That's a problem. Uh, let's get a barracks. I don't know what I'm gonna do with the barracks. Uh, yeah, I need about three Jarman kills right about now. I don't think that's gonna happen. And I need to have perfect micro and not have my units be attacked at all. Oh, look at that. He actually is mismarkering slightly? Yeah. We're in a tough spot, boys. We're in a tough spot. He could just come in with the overlords. One stinger's not gonna do shit. Yeah, that's what he's doing. Yeah, it's over. Fine, it's GG. Sense. All right, fine, Logica, you win. I'm doing surrender. There we go. Now let's actually see how big he is. Okay, so he's got a nuke. He's got three oils. I killed a bunch of his hackers before, but he seems to have rebuilt just fine. We have TR here in pink. Oh, man, TR's fun. TR is also normal China. So it's a China off. Very nice. So Lakey's was China, Mr. Med was USA, and uh, Nick's loss was a USA. And I was the only GLA. And look at this MIG strike. Oh man, that is what China can do. That is why people get the MIGs. That kind of shit, you clear so much up of an enemy army. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's a bit... It's a bit difficult here for TR because he doesn't really have MIGs himself. He doesn't even have an airfield. There's an army here. 
Um, okay, so the thing about this is there are two infernos. If Logica put the speaker tower overlord next to these guys, they will start an inferno uh, like a firestorm. If he just leaves them like this, they won't start a firestorm. So those are little tricks. Um, but I don't think Logica gives a shit. He's got an army strong enough. He can take down this guy. No issue at all. Uh, carpet bombers seem to have failed here. I think I was trying to kill the army. And uh, TR coming in trying to uh, save himself, but we have another MIG uh, volley up. Look at this. All these guys. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So that's three airfields worth of MIGs. Yes, in fact. And that's very scary. That can do serious fucking damage here. They can, If it strikes on this Overlord and this Overlord, that basically eliminates this army, I think. But let's have a look. Logic is very good. Let's see what he's going to do. And he strikes the front one. All of them on the front one. I don't know if that was maybe a bit of a waste. Because the actual missiles themselves do pretty good damage against tanks. So now these overlords are a bit low health. So this guy's half health. This was nearly dead. And uh, angle's a bit bad here. And TR surrenders. Logica takes the game. GG. Ah, oh, nice. Ah, oh, that was good stuff, man. I tried hanging on. It's a miracle I actually collected this much. Look at that. 76k. I had one market for just a short period of time. And uh, TR did a good job by the looks of it. And Logica, look at that. 152 kills. Very, very nice. Well done. Well done. So, I think what I will be doing next is... I think I will cut the stream here. And start looking at those glorious replays from the challenge we had today. And I will see and verify if the winners are in fact correct and if it makes a difference uh let me just check my discord how many people have messaged me in the meantime i have oh only four people four people have messaged me so far oh my god naughty naughty but yeah i was expecting a few more people i'm gonna stop so yeah i hope you all enjoyed the stream tonight guys i know that we have the challenge today and i kind of felt like playing a few games afterwards I did a few games afterwards and uh, yeah, very unfortunate that Sniper couldn't make it, and uh, as a result, we had Malik play in his stead. Malik still did a good job, and uh, we had some great games. And yeah, I guess I will see you all next week. Good night, guys, and see ya.